my baddest motherfucker in the world. Much love, homie. Just wanted to pop in and show some love. Got some stuff going on and I've only completed shift one. So no spoilers for butt cheek. Much love, all have fun. Butch 7 love Freddy Butch. I was waiting the whole time, Fry. I was waiting just for you. 
Hello, everybody. Welcome in. Is that a serial killer? Uh, no. Carl Casey is not a serial killer. Although he's been killing it with these ah! beats, am I right? <laughs> Rigged. <laughs> uh, welcome in, everybody. Welcome in. Um, so tonight is going to be a bit of a special night. Um, hi, Rye, Twy, Soma, Twy, Jug. <laughs> Hope I didn't miss anyone. I think you missed Twy. Uh, so tonight's going to be an interesting night. Um, it's going to be the first of two sponsored streams from HelloFresh. Uh, we've been doing this now for a little over a week. Um, trying to get some new subscribers to HelloFresh. Uh, and it's me bringing the good word to you. Uh, I have had a lot of opportunities to do different sponsored things. Creepy, what's up? Welcome in. Uh, and, and this is the first one that jumped out to me because I was like... I actually use this product. Like, I don't play Great Shadow Legends. I don't play Genshin Impact. Like, and I'm not saying like it's necessarily a bad thing. I just wanted to get behind something, a product or a service. <laughs> Thanks, Knox. Uh, that I, I that I'm not just spouting some bullshit about. Like, I actually have a meal in the fridge. Um, it's, oh god, what is it? Yeah, I know it's pork. I know it's pork. And I can't remember what else goes on it. But it looked really good when I looked at the card yesterday and I forgot. I mean, tell a fresh once too, it's actually not bad at all. Yeah! Um, not to get by. You calm down, Polish. Um, yeah, it's, it's, it, what's nice too is the menu changes up pretty frequently. Um, and, and seasonally too. And... You can also pause for, you know, an X amount of time as you wish. So that way you're not like stuck having to get meals every week. And then you have bags and bags and bags of produce and meat just sitting in your fridge. You know, you use it as you want to. Only well, was it too expensive, but I see they changed prices. You know what? I, I feel like they may have dropped some stuff too. Because I remember when I first heard about it around the same time that like Blue Apron Kitchen and the other ones were out, and it seemed pretty expensive. Um, but I feel like it's at least some different plans are better than others. Um, yes, and don't forget, so you'll see it all in there. Uh, stream Elements is automatically punching it out. Um, otherwise, you can do a, an exclamation point, um, hello fresh, and you'll get the message here to use the code which is the POGHF117. You get up to 16 free meals. You get three surprise gifts. I don't know what they are, but we're all going to find out at some point. And that's across six different HelloFresh boxes. Um, and of course, you get free shipping on the first box, which is great. Uh, so you can use that link right there. It'll bring you right to it. Or you can um, you go to HelloFresh.com and just make sure you use that promo code because that tracks specifically to me. Um, so... I want to demo the website. I'm going to put an order through. We're not going to do it right now. Um, I wanted to start off with a, a good shift or maybe two of Mortuary Assistant. And then we'll take a pause. Uh, and I'll, we'll run through it, you know, 15, 20 minutes. Uh, if the free gift isn't a giant ring pop, I'm canceling my subscription and sending the box back. <laughs> All right, Soma, I'll let them know. Um, so yeah, so I think we'll we'll do Mortuary Assistant, do a shift or two, and then we will go ahead and I'll show you the demo, and we'll uh, we'll talk about it a bit, and we'll jump back to Mortuary Assistant, play it for a bit more, and then I'm gonna do a little bit more of a talk towards the end, and then we'll get another solid hour after that, and then we'll uh, we'll wrap up and we'll raid out. So that's what the night's gonna be like tonight, and then. I'm going to be aiming for either late next week or over the weekend, depending on when the box comes in. It's usually about a week. Uh, I will do an unboxing here live on stream. We'll go through everything together. Um, unfortunately, I'm not going to cook anything because I don't have, I, I cannot just mobily move my entire office into my kitchen. Also, I'm a wreck when I cook food. I get very agitated with myself. However, um, I can at least show you guys what everything looks like, how they portion everything, 
uh, the instruction card. Like, it's they make it pretty simple. Like, if I can do it, fucking anybody can do it. <laughs> Cooking stream? No! I'm really hogging out of my mind. <laughs> Stop. Oh, God. All right. Without further ado, um, well, I think it's, I get some water first. I'm pretty parched. I've also been drinking a ton of water today. I don't know why. Might be dying. Guys, Jug said he's doing a cooking stream for... No, I did not say that. I said I cannot get everything down there. <laughs> it's not possible. The day that I can figure out how to... How to get a, a, a brew stream going, where I brew a beer out in my driveway, I'll consider a cooking stream after that. How about that? You underestimate, you underestimate my ability to set cars on fire outside while cooking rice. I I never said that I underestimated that. I never said you couldn't do that. Bro, I'll do a fucking cooking stream. Sounds rad. Knox, I don't think cooking instant ramen is a cooking stream. Get it? It's a, it's a you know, it's a joke because you're in college. It's all right. At least you're, if you're doing, like, the packages of ramen, you're a step for me. I had, like, the fucking styrofoam cups. And I would le legitimately nuke water in a cup in a microwave and pour it into that thing. That actually happened. Again, I'm still not surprised. I don't, like, what do you want out of me, Soma? I'm not going to give you a fucking piece of rhubarb barber's rhubarb pie. Cannibal stream called Hello Flesh. Oh, because that's metal. <laughs> oh, my God. I'm tired of going. No, that was good. Uh... <laughs> But I feel the tiredness, man. I feel it. But hey, it's pre-Friday. We're almost there. But yeah, let's uh, let's go and bomb some bodies. Where's my catcher? There it is. Okay, it uh, it took a second. I was a little worried. Uh, so again, I've got the first ending, which was like. I feel like you're supposed to get that after the first night if you guess it right, because it's like you're. It's explained to you like what's going on and how you're basically going to be stuck doing this and fighting off demons every night because they're going to follow you wherever you go. The second ending, um, what's the second ending? The second ending was acting as if you got the wrong body and you get possessed, and you fucking murk the doctor the next morning and then the third one is you wake up because you get the body right and the demon right like the name and everything and the doctor's like you, like, you did a great job we'll be doing this forever go home and rest up and come back tonight hello fresh presents mortuary assistant boneless thighs <laughs> damn all right so there's two other endings I haven't got yet, and I'd like to get them. Um, I'm assuming one of them has to do with the basement. I don't know how to get down there. I know there's a bulkhead out back. It's got a lock on it. There's got to be keys somewhere. I found an old set of keys in a drawer, but I literally can't do anything with them. I can't pick them up. It's just like, it's like, oh, an old set of keys, a spare set of keys, and I can't grab them. So, I don't know. We'll, we'll look around in some other drawers, maybe. Um, see what I can uncover on this, uh, this first shift. Uh, and I need to move this over here. Oh, that fucking music is so baller. I can't find a good place to put this window. I need another fucking monitor. That's what I need. I mean, I don't really need it, but, you know. There. That works. Okay. Where was I? So, here's my keys. Keys to the apartment car in the front door of Riverfields, which is the uh, funeral home. Nothing in there to grab. I can't go into my own bathroom because it's locked. And I remember I've gone through a bunch of this and, like, none of the... Oh, that opens. Oh, well. Nothing super helpful. None of these open. Like, I, I tried this, I remember, the first night to see if I could do anything with this. And there's the Death of Decay book. 
And yeah, there's there, there's nothing really hidden in here. Um, music band shirt. Also, isn't that the mortuary assistant? Uh, like, look, yeah, right there. Look. Huh. Clever branding. I'm gonna leave the music running for the uh, animals we don't own in this house. Let's go. Um. Man, I really I want to know how to get in the basement, and then I have no idea what the other, um, what the other one's gonna be. So before I even go in there, I want to show you the back. So here, like it's even lit up too. Like, hey, look at us. And I can't, I can't get in there because it's locked. <clears throat> Problem is, I don't know where those keys are. I may end up having to cheat and figure it out. Maybe after I give it another go. Oops. Yeah. Am I supposed to throw this? Yep, throw the vase. Achievement unlocked. Fucking knew it. Right, we've got that. And then this just has my uh, the audio recorder in it. I don't think there's any keys in here. Felt check. No. Okay. Need this open for later. Break one of the vases. Oh, I was just kidding. Well, I remember reading an achievement earlier that said break the vase or throw the vase or whatever and I was like, oh, okay. Let me go check these other drawers down here. I have this is I already read this. There's nothing else there. What was that? Oh, stapler. And that's really it. There's really nothing else there. And then all these other drawers are gonna have stuff I need or I think that I What is that? All right, so it's seven. It's seven digits. It's gotta be that thing we found before, with ends in like forty-four or whatever. I never noticed that before. I actually, can leave those open. Um, not opening the windows. And here's these keys, extra keys. But I can't take them. The E button's not there. If I could close my finger in a drawer, it would have been here earlier otherwise. Dude, that fucking sucks. 0451 is not enough, actually. Yeah, so Zoe had asked for the extra key. And there's no mention. And I can't even take my own access card, which is like, why? Can't open that. Okay. So, there's really nothing much else I think I could even do. Let's make sure I can still draw. Okay, I'm still scribbling. We're good. So, basically, when that scribble turns into a symbol, that means I'm basically about to be possessed. Oh, don't mind. I'm going to sit back. Try to relax a bit. I know. It's funny how I'm saying trying to relax playing this fucking game, but here we are. All right. Come on out. Relax. I'm back. Joe, are you going to do a cooking stream? Chat says yes. No! Yeah, I'm a baddest motherfucker in the world. Oh. 14 months of fry. Thank you so much for your continued support and awesome friendship and, and being an all-around fantastic mod. Super appreciate you. Her tongue's hanging out of her head. Do you see that? That's hysterical. Um, I said the day that I figure out how to get um, how to get like a, a, a like a, a live stream where I get to brew a beer out in my driveway, then I'd consider doing a cooking stream. It's gonna be a lot of work to figure that shit out, but we'll get there. And fry, I don't, I I'm sure you missed uh, next week. Get out of here, Twy. There we go. 
Um, are we going to open up a uh, record system? Whoops. Wall trend. Be quiet. Stop talking. Someone's singing over there. Something. Waltrod Vincent. What a strange name. I've never heard of such a name before. I'm always a good boy. I gotta troll sometimes, Jug. I know, I know. It's completely fine. I'm not mad at you. I'm just very disappointed. <laughs> Okay, so we've done that part. Now, we gotta go stitch that jaw shut so that I don't see the tongue anymore. And yes, the teeth look a little too good in this game. It's very, very unsettling. Did you know your pupils are the last part to stop working when you die? They dilate. My wife asked me the other day where I got so much candy. I said, I always have a few twicks up my sleeve. Oh. I hate my job. All I do is crush cans all day. It's so depressing. Oh, Who were the greenest God. presidents in U.S. history? The Bushes. Hi. Hi, Meanie. Oh, okay, it's this one. Okay. Back to work. <laughs> Can I please put the eye caps in? Oops. There we go. It's so bad, like, I'm kind of used to what to expect now. In, in most cases, I think. So, like, if I see it, I'm like, I know how this is going to react. Um, there's still things, though, because I've been watching other streamers play, and something will happen to them that I have not seen before, and I'm like, what? I have, I have played seven shifts so far, and I've got all the endings. How am I missing something? It's very concerning. Alright, let's go get one of these things. Whiteboards are remarkable. Magician is just over it. Whiteboards... You know what? No. We've already made this joke before, Tree. And it was bad the first time you made it. <laughs> but it's still funny. Alright, get this, get this, get my tubes. Where my tubies? There's my tubies. Alright. Let's get to work. da 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 da, -da. Oh, I never got one of those cards. Fuck. Alright. Start them up. Let's -a go! Oh, yeah. Shit. Where was this one? It's like halfway down the hallway. Oh, I think that's it right there. No. Fuck. Yeah, hold on. Maybe it was in the bathroom. Yep. That is a... Uh, looks like a J and a P or something. I don't know. Let's go take a look-see. Ah, uh, you calm down. Where do birds like to eat at restaurants? On the ground level. Why? Why do you do this to me? <laughs> all right, what's next? Oh yeah, turn everything off, move the pump, and all that good stuff, and stitch them up. And now it's our. I'm sorry, what? Did someone just... Call my name? I 
Anywho. Best part, jam it up in there. Gotta fill that body cavity with body cavity fluid. Mmm. Yeah. Delicious. If someone trips on a vegan first aid kit and dies, would go. they have died from natural gauzes? Oh! To the bathroom. Hey, Jugs. <laughs> yes. Uh, yes. I'm waiting. Uh, other side of the door? Yep. That is the good looking three. Did you know the first French fries weren't cooked in France? They were cooked in Greece. Ah, f Unbelievable. Okay, and before we do the moisturizing, I had to get the good looking three. It's right here. Pop it there. Great. I thought someone was there. The, the shadows are starting to fuck with Coffee me in this has game. Finally overtaken speaking Arabic as the most taboo thing to do in an airport. <laughs> right. uh, that one was good. I will 100% give you that one, Tree. That was funny. <laughs> hey, fuck you. I'm not answering the phone. I'm busy. Like, who tries to like? Who calls this late at night? I'm more, like, I'm this fucking. Is it a mortuary that I'm in? No, it's it's a, like a funeral home. Kind of. I don't know. Regardless, who's calling at this hour of the night? You looking for Steve York? Oh, he's here. I'm looking at him. Trust me. Alright, Steve York. Let's get you ready for your big day, bud. Feet wiggle. Fucking fine. Hello? Hello. Rebecca? Rebecca? What the? Rebecca. Rebecca. I get it. That's my name. And it's me talking. Chug, you're beautiful. Oh. I asked my date to meet me at the gym, but she never showed up. I guess the two of us aren't going to work out. <laughs> Some old. And no, Nox, you. Okay. Why the hell did they name them soldier ants and not combatants? <laughs> combatants. There we go. Yeah, okay. I don't think there's going to be anything else there. Alright. Let's get working on the jaw. Let's see how we're... Sc All right, it's starting to turn into a circle. That's not a great sign. But, uh... We do what we do. Can I please... I can't yet. I need to print the report. Okay, entry number two is Steve York. 53 years old. Let's get all this shit done. Advertisement. Rebecca, come here. Oh fuck. Rebecca, come here. Come here now. Oh god damn it. Do not touch must be one of the most Mom. terrifying things to read in Braille. God, that's that is terrible. This one, this one is actually a pretty good jump scare. It's not going to get me this me time, though. Want. He's dead because of you. You should be the one here. Lifeless. Lifeless. That's how I get up in the morning. Give it a minute. <laughs> that's so good. It's so good. 
Like that that first the first time I saw that scene, I literally just like froze up. Like I felt everything just break inside of me. I was like, okay. And I had oh, I didn't have the report. I printed it, but I couldn't pick it up. Rebecca, come here now. Rebecca. Rebecca, come here now. Rebecca, come here now. Yeah, boy. A little bit more. Every little moment gets a little more aggressive. Alright, we're good to set these, uh... Set this jaw in motion. And back. Bye, ads. How does cereal pay its bills with ch... Oh, my sweet fucking Jesus. There we go. Like, I don't know how many times you gotta keep telling me these really goddamn bad jokes. But they're not getting any better. <laughs> Alright, right, that's good. Yeah, 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 yeah. Alright. I gotta embalm this guy, Mr. York. Ah, uh, yes. I once That's why I love that one. Pub called the fiddle. It was a violin. God damn it. Oh, fuck me. Oh. I have to go over there because I need to... I have to go and make the cut on this thing. Ugh. Might as well get ready. For anyone who hasn't seen this game, I'm so sorry. Oh, Jesus, Knox. My God. Must be over a hundred Kuriks. Dad, are you all right? Yeah, I'm... No, I'm good. Feel a lot better. Well. Cooking with hot sauce stream. I think we'd have to do it at that point. Anywho. Some of you already know what this is all about. And before we get started, I just remind everybody, because I have to. <clears throat> Please make sure you use my link or go to HelloFresh.com and use the code for them 16 free meals across seven boxes and three surprise gifts and free shipping. Across seven boxes, isn't it six? It's six but Why is there PDF telling me seven? It is six. Speaking of fresh, I did say boxes. You ordered a box. Um, I don't know why I'm going into my fridge. That's that's not where the hot sauce is. Um, so, all right, let's see. Which one are we doing today? Why is the timing screw up sometimes? Okay, we're back. We're back. Okay, very sorry about that. Uh, <laughs> goodbye, Fresh. Hello, Fresh. Um, I should probably make sure the spinner button isn't beneath my stream on off button. Uh, that's a first, but it's better be a last. I, um, you know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna go and move it now, probably. Because I don't want to make that mistake ever again. <laughs> of course, of course. <laughs> Glad to be back. Let's spin the wheel. Oh. oh my god! Oh. I guess I deserve that after what just fucking transpired. Oh. Yeah, this is definitely punishment. This is gonna hurt a lot. I'm adding plus one to my death counter that's not even there. Let's see if that be all. Alright, calm down, Meanie. <laughs> By the way, Meanie, if you don't mind. 
because I know that you are one of the two people that ordered boxes so far from HelloFresh. If you go into the Discord, there should be a food prawn channel. Um, if you want to just share with us like what meals you ordered, you don't necessarily have to wait until the boxes show up. If you want to, that's cool too. I'm just curious what you got. Who knows, maybe this will just restore my back and I won't have any more pain and I'll thank you for it, Nox. But who knows. I'll do it when the box show up. I kind of want to make him then take pics. All right. Before eating. Yeah, word, word, word. I got you. Well, I can show the recipe for the three I got. Yeah, absolutely. Please do. All right. So this is the second hottest hot sauce in the box. It's not good. It is number 11. The double hockey sticks, if you will. If HelloFresh is watching, I'm very sorry. <laughs> oh my god. Oh. oh, this one is equally hot as it is fucking disgusting. Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> no, I slurred them fucking gift. I love that emote. Oh. And of course, I, I got a little, uh, a little hungry earlier today and I ate all my crackers. Oh, wait! I know something that can help. Hold on. So I know this is a HelloFresh sponsored stream, but I got a snack magic box from work. These right here. Oh my God. Absolutely killer. My last girlfriend broke up with me because I didn't open the car door for her. I just swam for the surface. Whoa. <laughs> Dark but funny. Mm. Yep, coffee chews. Uh huh. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. It's kind of working. So I joined the Discord. Oh. My word. Oh. Jesus Christ. Uh, Twy, they're like, uh, at first you, f you feel like it's gonna be a hard candy, but they're actually chewy and they have like a coffee, like, filling not like coffee coffee like some type of like cream that has a coffee like flavor they're very good oh um by the way where the hell are you there you are <sighs> all right twy i just gave you uh streamer permissions as well in the discord and I'll add you to my stream cord bot later too. Okay, I feel like I don't have you. Welcome. All right. Oh boy. Oh. 
Let's try to get back into it, okay? Oh boy. All right, I'm gonna sit back. Adjust pillow. All right, going back in. That's right, I gotta make the incision. Oh, fuck. What? Why? What the fuck? Oh, fuck! Bitch, come on. What the hell? Uh, hi? Am I supposed to t Oh, I'm supposed to touch you. Oh, okay. It doesn't let me touch you from the front. That's odd. Let me touch you from the side. What? All right here? Right. Right there. Those are the doors. Are you just stuck there? All right, well, the hell with you. Monka TOS. <laughs> oh, God. Okay. Oh! Jesus, that was quick. Uh, sideways three. Text to speech is out of stock. <laughs> it's been used quite a bit. One more mark to go. We're halfway through the second body, and that bitch is still chilling. If I approach you with this out, is it going to do something? No. It's so bizarre. I wonder if that just glitched. Was I not supposed to turn the light on or something? Whatever. All right, we'll get back to work then. Demon, how you been, my friend? How's football doing? more of a circle. Okay, let's get the uh, tro car. IV bag. Oh, you're gonna run it me out. Yep. I didn't like that. I remember that. Yep. Oh, she's still there. Fuck me. I thought she disappeared when the other fucking thing showed up. Oh, my fucking... God. Oh, fuck! God damn it! You still there? Oh, good. All right, everyone's gone. Did I fill this? I did now. Just got home from a scrimmage against Hudson. Very good. What position or positions are you playing this season? Come on. There we go. Excuse me. There we go. All right. We did the tro car, which means oh yeah, I gotta go to the bathroom now. X and wide corner. What do you mean by X? I know what position Jugs always is. <laughs> Alright. Let's go try to find this other uh, sigil. My guess is I'm not going to find the other sigil until the last body. Yep. Cross, I'm assuming. Cross what? I don't know these names. I go by what's on fucking TV. Oh, fuck me, you motherfucker. You weren't there two seconds ago. Ah! Oh. God damn it all. All right. Has this guy been moving at all? I don't think he has any more marks on him. 
That mole was there. He's got the thing on the other side of that. And... Yep. Get. It must have been that one that was just banging around because this wasn't doing anything and this wasn't doing anything. Wide receiver. Ah, gotcha. Although I guess it could be this guy because... If that's already open, that couldn't have been moving anyways, because I can't close it. All right, we'll come back to it. We'll come back. We got a whole other body to go through. There's also an achievement to not uh, embalm all the bodies and still get the demon right, and I feel like that's a pretty cool challenge that I'd like to do at some point. Who knows, maybe we get an obvious sign of who the demon is up front, we'll just embalm that one person and call it a fucking day. I mean, it's an idea at least. Nothing here. Nothing there. I got Nothing the words there. jacuzzi and yakuza confused. Now I'm in hot water with the Japanese mafia. <laughs> mafia. Yeah, those are two words you really don't want to mess up. <laughs> Depending on its usage as well. Oops, there we go. scratch that. That's it? I'm checking the arm. I always check. There we go. She just knows that we're already done. Like, how, you didn't even look. Alright, last one. We got Troy Cook. 35. Got some stuff on the shoulder. Mild abrasions on the left leg. And that is it. Yeah, there are two X and Z. X on the line and Z is off the line. Oh. Gotcha. Alright, let's go file this one. Okay. And let's get to work on this last guy here. Shut the doors. I Thank you. La da 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 Hey! How are you, and did you game or stream crash? Um, my stream didn't crash. I pressed the wrong button. And, uh, I have to hit back and then click on it again. That's silly. Um... I, I hit the right. wrong button and it killed the stream off and I had to reset it. Um, 100% my bad. Hit the wrong button. Uh, I was trying to hit the spinner button and my fingers slipped and hit stream. And it uh, put me offline. So here we are. I, I apologize to everyone that just got the notification twice that I went online today. <laughs> I need the uh, reagent. Yeah, I ended up moving the button over so I won't make that same mistake again. But still, it's like, wow, Jug, what are you friggin' doing, buddy? Uh-oh. Getting close again? Did I miss something? No, maybe not. I'm still trying to understand, like, what this... When everything kind of goes orange like this and fuzzy... Well, we know who the body is. Let's go find this last fucking letter. Fuck. We don't know it yet. I had a laptop I was always, I always have it on the right where the numbers are stacked on each other for start and end. Ah. Uh, what am I doing? Oh, right. And I have... I have it all ready to go. Before I turn this on, I'm making another pass-through to see if I can find this last one. 
Because if I can avoid him bombing this body, I can then get that achievement of not embalming all of the bodies. And it's not going to help me, is it? I'm going to have to turn the fucking thing on first, aren't I? Don't you ba -da -ba -ba forget about me. Don't, 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 don't you forget about me. Okay. You're really obnoxious right now. We done? Yep. Alright. Trocar? Trocar. Uh, I don't need that. I need this. And then fill it. Yeah, I shut up, 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 up. Oh my goodness. It was opening one that had nothing in it. And this one. Fuck. Now I really- OOOH! Ah! Fuck. Goddamn, good timing twisted. Ah, fuck! What the fuck happened there? Did I get launched? God damn it. See, again. There's just things I haven't seen yet in this game that apparently exist. Oh, hot damn. <laughs> How you been, Twisted? There we go. Okay, so there's that. Let's go to the bathroom. Gonna go mix the cleaners. All right, let me put take this out too while I'm doing it. Oh, fuck. I was about to say, I, I can't believe the, the rain just stopped. We just got transported. I fucking hate this part. This is going to open. I'm going to close it and... Good! You thanked me for the clip? You're the one that did it. Oh yeah, this is where we have to get all of our goddamn shit together as if we're going to do drugs. Uh... Wait, why do I need to go to the bathroom? Where the hell is it? Oh, is it on the toilet? Uh, the tub? Yeah, okay. <sighs> Find the lighter. That's right here. Spoon from coffee table. You accidentally activate the roller skates. Alright, and here we are. We're gonna get ready to do some stuff that we're not supposed to be doing, but... Creepy bitch coming out the tub. The weird spider one. <laughs> Too much power wash, Sam. I want to power wash that room. <laughs> What's up with the creepy music that's still going? There it is. The T L thing. No, it's not too late. Uh, no, I just closed it actually. This thing. All right, so you got the weird J three sideways three thing. And I'd say this is the oh fuck! I never got the key code. 
I don't like this music. 20251. Two o two five one. Is this a desolation? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, boom, boom. Not quite. No. This is it right here. So three T dots J. No, it's broken through. It's not sideways three. Shit. Maybe it's not desolation after all. Okay, it's not invidious. Shit. Did I fuck something up? Hiya! This is it right here. It's bomb at. Okay. So we've got that symbol. I actually think I ever got almost the right order. Would you fuck off already? I'm trying to get work done! Eyeless bitch. Not anymore, I'm busy. Jug, can I give you a hint? About what? I don't think I had it right with Invidious. Let me in, you bitch! Let me in, you little bitch! Ah, see, it updated to the fucking M. It is immolation and it's ball mat. Those are the four that I have. I think that goes over there. The threes are on the sides. Okay. Now I've got it. Oh, I had to put it back, though. I'm not done with this body. Get the bag used bad on bunny boy. Put ashes on body. Use ashes with lighter. Burn it. What? Get the bag used bad on body. Burning boy, put ashes. What the fuck is bunny boy? Like what? I mean, I get it, burn burning boy, but get the bag. What bag? Use bag. Like I need a fucking Rosetta Stone to read that. <laughs> I thought demons autocorrects were bad, but my fuck. What are we doing with this dude right now? I might as well just finish doing this then. Fuck it. Okay, Chug. <laughs> colostomy bag? God. I don't think there's any colostomy bags in here. It wouldn't be very helpful. Jesus, I hate when I do that. Alright. So it's one of these two, I feel. She was moved out. This dude's door was opening, but it's not necessarily about the body. How much time we have? Not much time. I have to make a decision, and I have to go with her. Her... She was actually out... Mm, well, I don't know. Get the bag. What bag? Use the bag on the bottom of the crematorium? Oh, yeah, look at that. 
get ashes by doing that. Put ashes on body. What does the ashes do? What bag are we talking about? I'll have to do it on the next... Oh, fuck! I have to do it on the next shift. This is... I'm running out of time. This music is not helping. I'm out of dinner, you fuck. Yeah, fuck you. Cremation bag across from furnace. Oh, these. All right, cremation on bag. Matches are in the. Oh yeah, I usually pick up the matches. I never knew what it was for. I'm going. Now, do I light them? That's not it. That's not it. I, I was running out of time. I, I panicked. I'm sorry. Oh, put ashes on the body? Damn. Okay, so I had to take the ashes out, put them on the body, light them on fire, and is that before or after I put the uh, the mark on them? Like, am I... Oh God, the flashbang. Like, am I supposed to put it on... Like, am I... I don't know. I, do, do, I, I, it's I'm I, surprised you are responding during a dinner. Thank you for that. You didn't have to be here. I think you can just call me. Well, I got the right body anyways. <laughs> um, this is the good ending, because we said Mr. Delver. When we call him by his first name, we already know it's bad. I never simply walked out um, after. So... You get used to it. My question is, I'll be sure to clean the floor am I taking the mark? So the mark that you Raymond, build, am I not putting that on the body and I'm putting ashes instead? Or I am I putting don't. both? And if so, which one goes first? I've been doing this a long time, Rebecca. I've traveled all over, learning everything I can. I've never found anything that could put a stop to it. So no, I don't think it does. So... We're just like this forever? Yes. It was hard for me too. But this is the life we get. We have to face our worst selves constantly. But the better we know ourselves, the stronger we are. Why don't you head home? Get some rest. Who knows what's coming tonight? So what the fuck do you do during the day? You get to have fun? Nothing bothers you during the day. It's only at night. Bastard. Ending two of five. We have completed seven shifts. We've been possessed three times. We've banished demons four times. We've embalmed 21 total bodies. We've burned seven of them. There's a lot of bodies to be burning, if you ask me. Okay. Um. Hmm. I think I'm going to try to go for one more. We'll do one more shift really quick. Um, and then we'll demo. Uh, Hello Fresh. TTS is on cooldown. Fun please. Wee woo. Um, well, you guys fucking used it like 3,000 times. I didn't realize there was a cooldown. It probably just said, fuck you. 
Because I'm pretty sure I shut that shit off. Like the cooldown, that is. I'm going to throw the vase again. Alright. I'm going to go start this now. Before I even get the clipboard. And I come over here. Now I have... That's not it. I have ashes. And I'll hold on to them. Oh, and I gotta get the, the matches, sorry. So, can I just put them on any body right now? It doesn't matter. It doesn't have to be, like, towards the end. Yeah, okay. This guy's got some fucking marks on him. Jesus. Okay. Uh, I'm just gonna bring him out here and do it here, I guess. Alright. So if I do this, ashes. So it instantaneously tells you which house it is, regardless of which is it, regardless of which body, or is this actually the body? Because it did that. It's not body info. Okay, so it's so regardless of which body you put it on, like if I went and did it again on a different body, it would do the same thing. It tells you the house. Okay. But that's cool. That's a quick little thing. That means I don't have to like be paying attention because that kind of messed me up last time. Was trying to go through all three houses because it looked like this circle, but it then it because I was like, oh, it's gonna be the the one on the far right, the desolation, and it wasn't. Have you heard about the restaurant on the moon? No. Great food, no atmosphere. It's <laughs> blue and not very heavy, light blue. I don't get why bakers aren't wealthier. They make so much dough. Oh. I can't take my dog to the pond anymore because the ducks keep attacking him. That's what I get for buying a purebred dog. Oh, for fuck's sakes. Okay. Well, now we know about the little trick, so that's cool. I can do that at the start of every single go. What's funny is, like, I'm... <laughs> what? What? Oh, what? thank you for the host, why? That was uh, slightly disturbing. I'm like, huh? What? Who? Why do I hear that noise in the game? Why is Twy in the game? Okay, we got that. Nothing here. Fuck you, I'm not looking out the window. Forgot about hosts, I'm sorry. What? Don't, you don't have to there fucking apologize. Please. I mean, if people want to host, I mean, I'm never going to force people to do anything. But all you'd have to do is go to your own channel. Even if you are not a streamer, you technically have one. You go to your page and uh, go into your chat and do exclamation point host space the juggernaut 6789. And that would, uh, that would uh, host us. I'm taking over your game jug. Maybe I'm the demon. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Whatever. I've seen this all before. If you're on mobile, you can just use the share icon at the top of the screen. Oh, yes. Thank you for that, Fry. I always forget about that. You're a soul, and I'm the demon. Mm, well, that's a valid point. I might have to fix that. Jesus. 
Thank you, Dragon. Thank you, Nox. On PC, there's a host button under sub button. Oh, there is? I don't think I've ever seen that. What do you call it? Samsung security team? The Guardians of the Galaxy. God. Unbelievable. Hey, I know what game that is. What are we? Hey, okay. Thank you, Fry, for the host. Wow, I get all these hosts. Thank you, everybody. So the reason why hosts are Jesus. The reason why hosts are important is the more hosts the stream gets, the more likely that the algorithm will push me up to recommended. Um and that way we could bring in new people. Uh potentially new followers. And uh with new followers we get closer to the five hundred follower mark and I get to absolutely die. So, I'm six. so after this, we'll do our demo of HelloFresh, and then I think I'm going to look up how to get endings four and five. <laughs> maybe. Or maybe just one of them. I don't know. What I do know is I want to get one of them tonight. All right. Let's see. That's yeah, still looking okay, I guess. Um, why am I so lost? Oh, okay. It's a host party while people are knocking on my fucking window. Oh, no, you don't want the methanol. Your insides do, but you don't. Oh! I didn't even mean to fucking do that, and I got a fucking sigil out of it. Fuck, I don't know where it is. Shit. Ah, uh, I hate when I can't find it. Oh, it's right there. It's the G. The G unit. Grab another one of those. Alright, let's get cutting. Cutting and pumping. Uh. Ah. So it's got to be something to do with the, uh, the, the, the key, uh, the, the key code over here. It's going to end in 44. It's like, the remember the four dashes in 44? It's something to do with that. Oh, okay. Uh, that's the TL thingy. Two quicks. Hello? Why can't I think? Here it is. Alright, while that's doing that, let's get this set up. 710946. Okay, cool. It stays out. Fuck off! We'll quickly get another one of these. Okay. Let's unhook ya. You're looking good. Now I need to... Is this our... Yep. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh-huh. Only found three endings. There's technically five in the game that they've listed. Um... But there's apparently, evidently, rumor has it that there's two other secret endings. So there's a total of seven. I've only found one, two, and three. Which I feel like are the easy ones to get just by playing the game. But four, five, and potentially six and seven are different. How to get them, I don't know, but we're going to be trying. 
There we go. Alright, gonna go to the bathroom, mix cleaners. This there's gotta be a hidden spot somewhere where that key sits to get into the basement. And it's probably behind well, hold on a second. And I still have yet to be able to have to use that. That's gonna be important for some reason. Imagine being able to get ending. I don't really know what that means. I don't know why you're yelling at me, Knox. Spending more money on Fortnite? No, I'm good. I am I am certainly good with that option. Oh, that's right. I forgot about that. I don't know why I closed that door. Kind of a dummy. Alright. I was like, if I get three fucking sigils off of this one dude, that's outrageous. All right, looking good, bub. Why are there two curses? I didn't like that. I didn't like it one fucking bit. All right. Let's go put you away. Your game is bugged. Yes. You've already tried doing the reinstall, oh, the reinstall and everything. It just isn't working. Yeah, it's it's definitely just gonna be a bug with the game. I'm sure if you open a bug report, there's gonna be a way they can figure it out and get it resolved in a patch. Goodness, mother effing gracious. Rebecca, come here. Ah, god damn it, this one again. Head over to grandma. Head over to grandma. Mom. Next chiropractor appointment is Monday. Hate me all you And then the uh, the fourth one's on Wednesday. He's dead because of you. You should be the one here. Lightless. This is actually what happens at the chiropractor. Uh, so we just have to find the letters. Uh, the sigils, if you will. So, for instance, um, that right there. And there's four of them. And we have to determine from that website that's on the computer, it's a database, it tells us what we're supposed to be doing. Um, I can't select that. That's some type of mark from a demon. Very strange. Juggernaut's he doing tonight? Oh, it's it's nice and juicy, sir. Is there something on his chest I couldn't see before? Yep. There we go. Mild abrasions, aka fucking scratches. Whitney Cummings, isn't that A a female and B um Comedian? I feel like that's a thing. Alright. Oh my f fucking dick.
Whitney could be a guy's name, buddy. No, I know that, but I'm saying I'm pretty sure Whitney Cummings, like that name in particular, is a comedian. Who happens to be a female. There we go. All right. Let's embalm this bitch. After pruning the rhubarb barbara barbara barbarian beards, the rhubarb barbara barbarian beard barber mostly with the rhubarb barbara barbarians went to the rhubarb barbara barbarian beard barber beer bar to rhubarb barbara barbarian beard barber beer barbable in order to take her along to the rhubarb barbara bar in order to eat some of rhubarb barbara's super rhubarb pie. Cheers. Cheers. I don't want this. What have you caused, Nox? Uh, Soma actually started that during my rage stream. That shit was fucking wild. You know, maybe I want the doors open this time, eh? Fucker. Alright. Let's go do some investigative work. Get off my bed. <laughs> There's Soma. Right there. That's that weird note looking thing. Ah. Jesus fuck, that was a loud knock. Oh my word. Alright. This guy is number three. It almost looks like my sevens I write. Oh. Well that's good. At least it looks familiar, you know. Like there's three different threes in this game that for sigils, and I'm like, yep, yeah, it's this one. It's the broken one. The good-looking one and the sideways one. <laughs> okay. Let's get cracking and stuffing. Filling you up with that goody good. Oh, my word. There we go. I was beating the shit out of his ball bag. <laughs> you were beating the shit out of his ball bag, alright. I don't know why the hell that door was closed. Nothing else is around here, right? No. Okay, good. Oh, something's going on. I'm sure it's not going to give me the fourth one now. But I might also take a walk around. Keep the legs going. Keep that blood flowing. It's good for you. As in real life, I sit here in a chair for hours on end and not moving. Alright, let's moisturize your face. My dog. There you go. Alright. Alright, get you away. Even though I'm pretty sure you're probably of concern because of the fact that you have a mark on your arm that I can't do anything about. Well, that wasn't nice. Hello? Oh no, MJ. Spider Man's gonna be pissed. Jug. Yes?
I'm, I'm waiting for further instructions from you, Knox. I can't grab that one yet. Right there. Nothing else. That's good. This leg looks fine. This leg is fine. And just up here on your chest, I have to grab. There we go. There we go. Nice. Let's do some printing. Entry three, MJ Paglia, 20 years old. Come on. Fucking old ass printer. Okay. And we're good. One more body to go. Uh, enjoy GTA 5, man. And, and uh, thank you so much for the lark. Thank you for the host. Appreciate you. So I'm trying to think of where... There's got to be a place where these... Uh, I can get... Oh, great. Now we get to go into the basement, but not really. Rebecca, Yo, G-Rope, what up? I've only done this one once, and I don't remember how scary it was. So, oh, this one. Let's just get this over with. Yeah, yeah. Oh my god! This is the key code! Look at the things on their heads. And it's a four. These last two are fours. Look at this one that we just looked at. It's the second to last one is a four. We already know the last two are four. Yes, yeah, you need something from here. I, I assume so. First one's a one. Okay. I gotta write this down. I gotta write this down. This is fucking important. So we have one. Underscore, underscore, underscore. Four, four. Do you have one? Oh, you already did that one. There's only three over here? Yes, okay. And we have these ones over here. You don't have anything on you. You have a zero to the left of that four. I need the snow pads to see you guys. Thank you, Limp. So it's one dash dash zero four four. Yep. I never noticed this before. I was just like, why are there numbers on this? It's so weird. Um, one dash seven zero four four. Oh, this is fucking huge. You don't have one on you, but the one behind me, I bet, does. Nine. One nine seven zero four four. Let's fucking go. Oh, right. It had the key in its mouth. Yeah, I forgot about that. I've only done this one once before. I don't see it in its mouth, actually. What the fuck? Did I pick it up? I did not pick it up. There it is. Number for an air filter in a Honda. <laughs> Fuck. Mm -hmm. Oh, this part, yeah. This is so cool. I like how it just like just sits up there in his throne. And this is particularly one of the houses. You deal with all the three different houses all the time. 
I slit my wrist. Doc's drinking it. And... Who is David Whitlow anyways? Dead and forgotten. <laughs> That's great. How much does an influencer weigh? An Instagram. Fucking God. Alright, come on. I gotta get up. I gotta get up. Sorry. Come on, move. I, the first time this happened, I thought it was actually an ending, and I was like, what happened? Like, there is no grave here. I just was, yeah. You know. Alright, we're gonna get back inside. I'm gonna go use this fucking key code. Hello? I heard that. I don't know which one it was, but one of them just made a noise. Oh, we're so far behind. That's okay. This is important now. Okay. One, nine, seven, zero, four, four. Let's go. I don't care if you possess me. I'm going to the fucking basement. See, that makes sense too, because that one was particularly like, it's Louis the Bulkhead. And it's like, and you go to this world, and it's like, there's numbers there. And, like, I didn't put it together the first time because I didn't notice the things above. Six feet under. There's a bunch of more supplies down here. That's cool. Shovel. TV. Dear Mr. Sally, it was a pleasure working with you, but I'm sorry to say that I simply can't afford to travel back out to you. I have more questions about the Athenian translations, but I was also hoping you could send over the documents you had shared on quarter letting. Honestly, any documents you would create copies of and send would be extremely helpful. The package accompanying this letter contains some of the clay carvings I have made in an attempt to create the symbols you shared. I've also designed a holder for them. My hope is to combine the markings and holder to comp comp comprise a demonic identifier that will also call the entity to it and bind it there if correct. Silver capsule in the center of the holder contains the ash of burned coffrous and is lined with demonic calling runes. Based on our conversation, I believe this can react with fresh blood from the possessed. Hmm. I wanted to request that you give the contents of this package a look and let me know if this seems like a viable method to bind an entity. With privacy also being extremely important to me, I wanted to request you please send everything back, including this letter. All my best, Raymond. Interesting. Mr. Delver, it is a great shame I will not be seeing you, but I appreciate you sharing this with me as this does seem to provide a reaction. And what you have made does make sense. It's a very clever way to identify a specific entity. However, I'm curious as to the reason for the body identification aspect is you would need the blood of the possessed inside the vessel, which I assume would already be the case and tendency would be obvious. So I don't really see the value of identifying the vessel. However, the demonic identification and binding aspect of this is fantastic. Thank you for sharing your work. It's a great help to mine as you have requested. I have returned everything with the shipment with great respect, Akil. So you need to have the bodies, you have to have the blood in there, so you're not supposed to embalm them. Why is he having me in Boston? May 29th, 1984. I'm not sure why I've decided to write this. I don't keep journals, but maybe the only way I can deal with what's happened. To get my thoughts out. I thought this was over, but it's happened to David. I remember so vividly what it looks like. I don't have any plan here. I just wanted to write. June 3rd, 1984. I keep thinking about David. I feel horrible. What he became was terrifying. I remember everything, but I wasn't... I ha but I haven't seen it in a living person before. I knew in my gut what was happening, but I couldn't believe it. It's been almost two decades. When the body came in, David almost instantly began to become irritable. We both knew something strange was happening, but it directly affected him. He felt sick and went home for the day only to return that evening, saying that he felt he had to come back and wanted to work. At that point, I couldn't ignore it. I tried to tell him he was in danger, that this was all real. He insisted on working, became irrational again, and asked to work alone. I again told him what to look for, but he dismissed me. I went and bought a camcorder and told him to at least record anything unusual. I wanted to be able to show him once he was in a moment of clarity, so maybe he would allow me to help him. But it all happened so fast and was over. Jesus. April 3rd, 1985. I don't know what else to do. I feel helpless. I'm so sorry, James. August 7th, 1985. 
Andrea now. It won't stop. I don't know what to do. Obviously, not everyone is susceptible. I've learned that much. It makes me want to never hire anyone again, but I can't lose the mortuary either. Even if I did close, it would still happen to me eventually. November 16th, 1987. I'm back to writing here again. It's been so long. I thought it was over, but I guess I've just been lucky. I'm scared. I was hoping this would never happen again, but I have a feeling this is only going to happen more. Poor Angela. This is a horrible existence. I almost fell a victim before. It's only a matter of time now until it chooses me. I don't want to be alone, but I think there's no escaping what has happened. I'll miss you always, Maria, but it was the right thing to leave you, to keep you safe. I know you would never understand. February 22nd, 1989. I took this journal away and forgot about it, trying to move on. I found it again today, and I guess I have been in a horrible place for a while now. I can't live with all this guilt. I feel so alone. I feel so angry at the life that's been taken from me. I sought my life to take care of her, and she brought this in. I can't blame her. That's not fair. It's not her fault. I have to find a way to stop this myself. I've just been sitting here, huddled in fear, hoping this won't happen again, that it won't happen to me. I don't have much money, but I need to start researching this in a real way. I need to take control. Jesus. You guys having fun with the emotes, eh? Ooh. I have a different tape I can play. I'm missing something. Uh, the cassette tape. This is Raymond Delver. I, I know this will sound crazy. I'll read this after. If I am to disappear, know that it was not of my own free will, and that I am a danger to anyone I may encounter. I should be killed on sight. This sounds. Sounds terrible, but the woman locked in the basement must also be killed. What the fuck? For anyone that may encounter this, if you are experiencing possession, the blood of the possessed will react to the name of the demon present. Injecting the blood of the possessed into a deceased body with demonic tendency will act as a reagent for revealing possession and form the foundation for. Ah, uh, so the reagent is basically the same thing as using the blood. Its name and burn. This should banish the demon. I'm sorry. I have not let her out yet. Know that it was only ever done to stop it all. I'm confused. It sounds... There's another key I need to find. Apparently. Well, we're running out of time. Fuck. I don't even know what the hell this thing is. Can I put something in there? No. I was curious if I could put them in there, but I don't know where this other key would be. Well, let me read this. March 27, 1989. Working relentlessly, and I believe I have made some progress. I haven't pieced together much, but I have found enough that has led me to a contact in Egypt. Flying out there in a few days to meet and talk about what's been happening. April 29th. My trip to Egypt was extremely successful. I feel I am broke now, but it was worth it. Mr. Salah is an amazing help. I've come back with mountains of documents and copies of religious texts I had no idea existed. It's changed a lot of what I believe. I'm going to start pouring over these and see what I can piece together. There's something here. I can feel it. December 8th, 1989. I'm so tired and angry. I feel so helpless. I can't do this anymore. Valerie didn't do anything to deserve this. None of them did. I can't bring myself to do it. I'm keeping Valerie here. I can help her. I'm sure of it. I feel like I'm so close to something that can stop this, but I don't know what I'm missing. I've been working on a number of things meant to com combat these entities. i found ways to uncover their sigils, which is promising. I've distilled this down to a science. I know I can find the missing piece. I will help you, Valerie. Journey 27th, 1990. I hate what I have to do. I have to feed her and care for her, even though she's violent and gone. It is far too similar to how this all began, and I hate it. God damn it, 30 years of this. I have a theory and I don't like it, but I can't let this happen to anyone else. This has to stop. I have some things I've been working on that I'm going to send off to Mr. Sala and get his opinion. If it's a viable method, I'm going to take this head on. If I can't stop it, I'll keep it at bay. February 18th. I received some great news from Mr. Sala. I've been fortunate enough to not have another comprise, 
compromised body of this point, but now I need one. My plan now is to work in the mortuary alone until this happens again. If I can establish myself as a potential conduit and survive the possession using these tools, I think I may be able to take control as well as keep this from happening to others. I don't know what this means for Valerie. It's the only piece of this I don't know how to live with, but I might have to. Otherwise, it's all been for nothing. Shit. So there's really no... I don't know if I can ever open up that door. That really sucks. I kind of wish I could. But uh, that's all interesting information. He's keeping someone that's possessed down there. I wonder if she's dead. And that's who that girl is in the black. Jug, do I want a hint? Yes, please. I have to go back down there. That's not good. I don't want to go back down there. Turn to right in the drawers and look. Do you mean like... Oh, you mean up here? The old keys? I can't take those. Bro, it's getting a little bit... It's a little worse than cold right now. Fuck. We were actually burning up. Well, I had to go do this really quick and get scared by the albino. I think this is Valerie at the end of the hallway, by the way. When we get here. Check the third again. I think this is Valerie. I think she's already dead. Oh, they put me outside. Jesus. Right, I guess I'll go to the front. Check the third again. I was looking. It just had some like shit. But uh, I, I'll check. I believe you. Third. I'm looking. Oh, come on! That one thing. I must have clicked on every other little fucking thing there, too. Ooh. Is this outside? Well, yeah, I unlocked it. Are you okay? Oh my god. Oh, oh, I knew you'd find me. Our secret oh, below. Achievement unlocked. Oh, That's the reagent. Don't you hear me? That's what he's doing. He's getting the blood from her. Oh! Why? I'm Rebecca. Look at you, look at you, look at you. I can't. You can look at me, though. Is Raymond here? 
No. Do you see what he's doing? Mm -hmm. Who can do this to someone? I think you should let me out. Sure. Tear out your fucking eyes! I'm going to cut you open and stuff the burning embers of this fucking building! Thank you, Twisted. <laughs> so, you want to kill me? Why, why would I let you out then? You'll be here soon. Okay. Well, he did make another one, so... Uh... That's fucked. Great. I don't think there's anything else I can really do in here. Um, so I'm gonna go... Unless I'm... Am I supposed to use this reagent on something? Because if I, if I am, it's kind of too late. I'm sure Nox will tell me if I need to do something. Bro, that's not even... Oh, the 69 is the other symbol, right. This one right here, it's Teshak. TL note G. TL note G69. That thing's still fucking going back there. I already have one of those. Oh. I didn't grab tubing. I can't use that here. Oh. Oops. She was there, wasn't she? Doesn't sound like you got too much Taco Bell. Huh. Oh, God damn, I was trying to sneak around it. Wake me up inside. <laughs> Stop it. Nox. So Nox, am I correct that I've done everything properly at this point? Like, I don't have to go and take one of the reagents from down there, do I? And use it on the correct body, so to speak? You don't, okay. It's just an achievement then, I guess. And it's not really an ending. Already part of the regular ingredient list. That's what I thought too. It just it looked a little different, like with the red label on it, but it may have been just from blood on it. Oh boy. We're running out of time. I don't like this music. I don't like it! Just don't get bugged. <laughs> Imagine if that's what does it. Come on, finish up. Scribble, scribble. Right. I'm 
gonna bring you back. It's not you, I don't think. I think it was the guy that had this symbol on him. Like the fucking... The mark that was on him. This dude here. Whitney. Because he has this mark on him right there. And um, I have not seen that mark before. And I don't believe that is the correct... It's, it seems weird that I can't mark it, like, on the sheet. I never grabbed it! Fuck! How are we looking? Oh, okay, we're fine. The music's just being very aggressive. We can do it. Yeah, yeah, I know. Alright, ship's over regardless. And... It went a lot longer than I thought it was going to go. <laughs> That's okay. So stay tuned after the flashbang. We'll be doing a demo on HelloFresh. So it's weird, even if you don't pick the right body, this scene still happens, and it's kind of confusing. Maybe that's also a bug, I don't know. Flashbang! Oh, this is different. What you've been doing is monstrous. I've said already that I've had to accept everything about myself. Just like you do. This is a necessary evil. Sick! She's down there right now, just suffering yes, for no reason. Yes, that's Valerie is not down there. Not anymore. She's been gone for years. You don't know that. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's not her. You're just gonna let her stay there. You don't know what she's feeling. You are torturing her. She's helping me survive. She's helping us survive. Without her, there's no reagent. Without the reagent, we have nothing. Or he waits until I get possessed and he life, does it. It comes with a cost. This cost. You have to make a choice. Just like I did. What choice? Keep her alive to just bleed her over and over again to save ourselves? If yes. she can't be saved, end the torture. I mean, she's down there suffering for your own gain. My gain? My gain. You used her too. It didn't stop you from finishing the job. You used her blood anyway. When it Fresh air fried to, boneless corpse by hell no survival, fresh. <laughs> just like I did. I can't kill her, Rebecca. I know it's the right thing to do for her. I know. She isn't the only one. What? I've seen many experience what you did. None have survived. Except for me. I've watched them degrade and suffer until they're no longer themselves. I didn't know what else to do. I couldn't just let them suffer. I searched for years to find a way to reverse it. All I found was the way to prevent more. Isn't that better than nothing? I've killed them all, Rebecca. It was the only thing I could do. So yes, I am a monster. But this one horrible thing has prevented me from having to take any more life. And I would choose that again and again. I can't live with any more death than I already do. I mean, look where he works. I've made peace with it. The choice is yours if you can, too. I'll see you tomorrow.
word. New ending. Ending four of five. That's their eighth shift completed. We've been possessed three times. We've banished five demons. 24 bodies and bombed. Eight have been burned. So that's four out of five unlocked. Uncount not counting the uh, the two secret ones. So okay. Uh, before we continue forward with more of this mayhem. It's time to talk about HelloFresh. Um, ooh. Banged the mic microphone. My bad. Uh, so. Alright. Boop, 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 boop. PDF thing over here. <laughs> Freshen your insides with a box of HelloFresh. I should have gone into marketing. <laughs> it's never too late, Soma. Come on. <laughs> uh, so before we begin, I want to remind everyone, if you are interested in setting up a subscription, again, it's not like a, you pay every week, you pay every month. You pay as you want to use it. You cancel it. You don't want to... Um, not cancel. You, you basically say, I don't want anything this week, and they don't charge you for it. Uh, but please remember... Use my link or go to HelloFresh.com and use that code. It's P-O-G-H-F-117. I believe that's it. <laughs> Make sure they didn't give me two different ones. Yeah, okay. It was the right one. So, sorry. <laughs> so, yeah, so, either use the link that's in there in the chat or go to HelloFresh.com. Make sure you're using P-O-G-H-F-117. You're going to get 16 free meals across six boxes, plus three surprise gifts. Um, you get free shipping on that first box as well. Pogging out of my mind. Yes, indeed. Um. <laughs> so uh, let me go ahead and jump on over to... Um, do I have a button for it? Oh, no, I do have a button for it. Woohoo! So... Um, here we are. So if you actually were to click on that link um, or, or type it in yourself, uh, it brings you to this page. It looked a little bit different maybe for you because I'm using dark mode because I'm not a psychopath. Uh, <laughs> but um, so this is how we set things up. It starts us off. We select the plan that we want to do. So I'm not really... I don't need to worry about family friendly stuff, right? So I like the idea of meat and veggies. Let's get rid of family friendly. Um, and quick and easy sounds pretty cool too. Uh, we'll leave it just those two, right? These are your preferences. Um, that way they just, they'll give you some relevant stuff up front. Um, and then you can also swap your proteins and sides if they're not the perfect match for you, which is pretty cool. Um, so they give you a lot of good control. Um, and it, it's, it's nice that you kind of have that ability to, to really cater to yourself, which is nice. Uh, so another thing too, is number of people, I don't need to get, uh, four people's worth of food. Um, we have been doing two, um, through my wife's account and it's honestly been enough food. Um, maybe I'll have a little bit of dessert afterwards, but I'm, I'm overweight and it's disgusting. <laughs> uh, and then, so that, so that basically drops you down a bit of price too, obviously it's less portion. Uh, and then recipes per week. So you can, this is up to you. Do you want two, three, four, five, or six? Um, of course, as, so three apparently is the most popular. I didn't know that. And obviously there's, uh, the numbers change, but, uh, so, you're, so they, they break it down for your box price, price per serving, and it's obviously a, a special here with my code. You save a bit of money per serving, and your first box total is also uh, greatly dropped down as well. So you see what the different box prices are there. Hidden by video. Oh, by my webcam, because I'm a dummy. Yeah, let me just, uh, uh, damn it. Why is this wigging out? Okay, sorry. 
So there it is. Let me scroll down a bit. <laughs> so that's with six. Let me go back to just two recipes per week. So your two recipes per week. So like for two recipes per week for a two-person household. Um, so you get basically two servings per meal. Um, your box price is going to be forty-seven ninety-six, so about fifty bucks. Price per serving is six dollars, which that's pretty sweet. And your first box total is actually down from fifty-nine dollars down to uh, twenty-three ninety-six with uh, with our code. Um, so I believe the code is already here. Yes, it's already been applied. I just wanted to make sure. And that's the point of clicking on the link is it will do that for you. So I want to do the basic two people, two recipes per week. Um, and we do select this plan. And that's going to move us forward. And now, um, so I don't have an account, so I have to register. Uh, we'll continue with Google and we'll do my juggernaut account. And uh, I'm, I'm just gonna fill out this information so I don't dox myself if that's okay with all of you. Um, but I swear there's nothing crazy going in here. It's just my information and I don't wanna share it. <laughs> Uh, you're like, no, I need to know what your credit card number is. Let's see. Um, so one thing, Jug's a government spy telling us to give people our address. Yes, of course. He lives in Cummington. I do. Uh, so I will read out to so the order summary. The meat and veggies and quick and easy plan. It comes up to forty-seven ninety-six. Two recipes per week for two people, four servings total. The shipping is usually ten ninety-nine, but it's free. It's a twenty-four dollar discount, and enjoy more savings for another five weeks. So that first, the first box is twenty-three ninety-six. The second box is forty seventy-three. The third is forty-eight eighty-eight, along with the fourth and fifth being the same with forty-eight eighty-eight. And then that sixth box is fifty-five eleven. So still saving money through six different boxes, which is pretty cool. I cackled. I know your name, Jug. I'm going to tell the whole world, but you can if you want to. Yeah, shipping is free for first box only. Um, it just, I, I believe that's what it was uh, saying. Um, so beneath that, it does give the first box total is $23.96. Johnny Sins, damn, you knew it. There's also a delivery summary. It says delivery instructions, which I can edit. But um, it says first delivery, and it gives me the date. So it actually comes out Tuesday, August 16th, which is great. And I'll, you, you will get your box every Tuesday. So that's nice. Um, there's also some FAQs down at the bottom. We're not home to receive my shipment. Um, you don't have to be. Can I change the time, date, and location of my delivery? Yes, you can adjust date and location of every delivery. And as a reminder, you don't need to be home to receive your box. And how often will I be charged? Your plan is weekly, but you can easily skip a week, pause, or cancel your account at any time. So make sure you do so before your weekly cutoff to stop your next order, which makes sense. Um, so I'm going to hit the next step button. And once they get through here and see what's on the next screen. Hello. Okay. So I'm at the payment information, but I'm going to... Charge you go, so it could do one box and pause, right? Yes, correct. Um, I'm going to share my display again because my credit card information is not in here yet. But what's important that I was just reading out to you is the order summary right here. Um, let me scroll down a wee bit so you can see a bit more of it. So again, you got your plan information up here. You got the shipping says free. I'm pretty sure it's only for the first box, um, which is $11 shipping. Discount is $24. Uh, enjoy your savings for another five weeks. So as you see, twenty-three ninety-six is your first box total, and then it goes up to forty seventy-three for the second week. And I believe that's because of your ten ninety-nine jumping in there, and then a little bit more. I'm assuming the discount drops a bit. And then weeks three, four, and five is up to forty-eight eighty-eight, and then your last box is fifty-five eleven. Anything after that, my assumption is that you actually the discount's ending. You're back to fifty-eight ninety-five as a default. 
Did I get the wacky three digits on the back? Yeah, sure. Um, and again, oh, my delivery address is right there. No one see that? <laughs> uh, so the summary is that it will first delivery is Tuesday, August 16th. I'll get a box every Tuesday after that. No special instructions for me. Um, so I'm going to go ahead. And, any idea what the free gifts are? I, I honestly don't. Um, doesn't say anything. I'm going to bounce back over here, though. Um, so I can handle it. Oh, I can use my PayPal account? Oh, I'm just going to do that. That's so much easier. Add your PayPal account info after you place your order. Oh, okay. That makes sense. So I can hit place order and select meals. And PayPal, it just had a pop-up come up. I'm just going to handle this really quickly. Apologize that I uh, am running through all this as quickly as I can. Okay. That is processing. Okay. I think we can go back in now. So, um, for a limited time, send your friends a discount to try HelloFresh. The best part, you'll earn discounts too. Um, I'm not going to bother with this right now because I have my own discount thing going on. But when you, if you decide to sign up for this and subscribe, um, you could obviously do this yourself. Send it to as many people as you want. This is actually how we got into it. Um, one of my wife's friends actually sent an email to both of us um, to get some stuff. But anyways, here we are. Uh, account was created. You'll get an email confirmation shortly. Help you get started. We sent two meals for your first delivery. You can choose meals until your next cutoff. If you skip customization now, we'll deliver our pre-selected meals to you. Select my meals. Okay, so yeah, so here it shows each of the uh, the weeks that you're expecting to get stuff. So you can actually select out. So it actually had me. It's it wants me to do a crispy crispy kicking cayenne chicken cutlets with mashed potatoes, buttery broccoli, and a honey drizzle. Bro, look at the menu options without getting a sub box in case you find you don't like any of them. Oh, that's good to know. Do you know if I could set up now and postpone first box delivery for a few weeks? That's a good question. Um, there's a bunch of stuff. All right, this is the menu boxes. I I'm honestly not sure, Fry. That's a good question. Um, let me just go back to transition over here, just really quickly, just so I can take a look through my account settings. Um. I'm just curious if All right, so there's a cancel plan button. Oh, you're gonna deliver you have to go to the deliveries calendar, okay. Which I think is where I just was. No, a little different. Okay. Um, uh, let's see. So... I guess because I haven't set anything up yet, it doesn't let me click on anything in here. Or maybe it does because I'm in dark mode. I can't see it. Oh, okay, I see. So I've clicked on that. What does that do? Ah! Okay, so I have clicked on the 16th. I'll share this again so you can actually see it. Um, I hate... Can I do dark mode and see... The, okay, so when you click on the day, so the 16th is my delivery day, the skip week button, I cannot skip. You have to do the first one. Um... But if I go to the 23rd, I, is the button I can skip this week, uh, the, the second week, and then so on and so forth afterwards. So the first box you do have to um, take on, for sure. Uh, but that's a very good question. Thank you for asking. Um, and now we kind of have that understanding. Uh, let me go ahead and go back to my menu. 
because I would like to pick out my stuff for next week. Oh, it, re it changed stuff on me? Skipped two pre-selected meals. I didn't want to skip it. I was liking what you had. White cheddar wonder burgers with Old Bay seasoning. Roasted broccoli, caramelized onions, and something or other. And it gives you, if you notice here too, it gives you about a, a time of how long it'll take to do these. Easy prep, easy clean up quick. Which is great, because for me, like, I I work until 5 o'clock, and my wife gets home around, like, 5 o'clock. <laughs> but I'll be going back to 6 o'clock soon, and, like, she just wants to get home and, like, put her pajamas on and just cook something so that we can eat and then we can clean up, get the dogs out, do their business, and then we have the rest of the night to kind of just hang out and do what we want to do. Helps a lot with meal planning. Absolutely. Yeah. Time estimates are nice. Yes, yes, absolutely. Um, I mean, there's, a, there's definitely a bunch of benefits from it too. Uh, like the, the quick and easy recipes, uh, and that explains why we have like the shorter ones, like the easy cleanups, easy prep, quick. Um, there's some, oh, carb smart, calorie smart. Like they have little, you know, other little things in here too. Uh, vegetarian meals. Um, just different ways to explain like, you know, some benefits of having this one versus the other one. This one's 10, 10 minute lunch. Look at that. A Mediterranean power bowl. But apparently I can't select it or something. Or maybe it's because I'm in dark mode. Huh. I don't know why I can't select it. Maybe because it's not part of my... Uh... Oh, I'm I'm on the wrong goddamn. I need this man. I'm over here deep throating a pop tart. <laughs> yeah, add cheesecake. You need to edit the meals you already have. Yeah, I I was on the wrong selection. <laughs> it's it's so funny. Like it's it's. I I want to like keep this on, but I couldn't even tell. Like there was no green mark there. I think it was on the week before. Um, so and that's the other thing too, Polish. I think like, um, like I mean, when I went over, when I was hanging out with you and Tree was there and, and Doc Islands was there, like when it comes to like grilling, like I'm with you, man. Let's grill this shit up. This is easy. Blah 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 blah. But like prep work, clean up, all like the cooking of the different sides. You're kind of like, oh, just let me cook some burgers, man. Oh. But, like, I feel like when these come in, I'm excited to unbox them with my wife. And, like, we, like, determine, like, okay, on this night we're going to do this one. On that night we're going to do that one. And, like, we'll do it together, which is great. You'll show the three you got tomorrow. Oh, great. Um, so they recommended, and it's weird that this is, like, grayed out. And maybe that's just because... I don't know why it's really grayed out. But I mean, crispy kicking cayenne chicken cutlets with mashed potatoes, buttery broccoli, and a honey drizzle. I think I'm gonna keep that. And it's spicy, 30 minutes. I am, I'm not gonna add vanilla cheesecake as much as I want to. And the other ones they're saying is meatballs with bulgogi sauce, plus roasted carrots, ginger rice, and creamy sriracha. Click edit delivery to change what you have. Gotcha. I see. You're not able to change the details of your first delivery. What? Is it because of like the cutoff time or something? Because it's it's Thursday night and this is what five days away. Let's see the next week. Yeah, I edit delivery and I can. Reschedule delivery, donate your box, or change box size. Uh, 
Uh, are you sure? Can I just not go down here and do... Oh, it's add extra meal. Oh, can I just do this? Yeah. I said hit the minus button. Tree. Tree. <laughs> it's all good, dude. I'm messing with you. Twy, which one is it? Was it the one that I just did that I got rid of? <laughs> if so, I apologize. Um... I'm also, so I'm also reading interesting statistic for you. The HelloFresh actually helps you save money if you were to go out, if you're a, 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 a restaurant goer. I, I like to go to a restaurant occasionally too, maybe once a week, right? Um, but it saves you up to 72, well, it's 72% cheaper than dining at a restaurant. And that's according to a Zagat dining survey. Uh, Zagat's is like legit, so. Oh, yeah, the lemony spaghetti one. We've had that one, too. Go to my next week. Oh, okay. Crispy cayenne chicken. Yeah, I'm gonna. I'm sticking that one. Um, and then you can go through here, and then they have available for the week. So every week it changes. Uh, but we have... So you can select all, just go through. There's quick and easy, new, fit and wholesome, best sellers, lunch, specialties, and veggie. Um, so what's specialties? What's that all about? Oh my. Ooh. See, unfortunately, I can't really, uh, I, I can't do seafood. I mean, I love seafood, but the wife will not eat it. So I, <laughs> I try to avoid it. But the uh, cheesy chicken and bean enchiladas sounds pretty cool. Uh, let's see what their best sellers are. Sesame soy pork bowls. 20 minutes. Beef flautas, flautas supreme. Flautas are fucking good. Brown sugar bourbon pork chops with apple pan sauce, scallion mashed potatoes, and Brussels. Oh, my word. Or a lemon tortelloni Palermo with roasted bell pepper and Parmesan. And you can add a protein if you want to. So what's new? Creamy aglio aeolio chicken pot. I don't know what the fuck. Did I even say that right? Chili flakes, aroma tomato, and chopped parsley. Also another spicy one. You got ancho barbecue burgers with grilled onion and roasted potato wedges. And red pepper jam pork chops with garlic lime broccoli and scallion rice. That sounds good. And then for quick and easy, one pan pork fajita lettuce wraps. That sounds pretty damn good. We got the sesame soy again. Bulgogi pulled pork wraps. Oh, this 10 minutes? Wow. One pan turkey stir fry tacos. Spicy coconut curry pork noodle soup. Whoa. Cucumber salads of pita pockets. One pot Italian garden veggie soup and gnocchi with spinach and tomatoes. My word. Yeah, the menus are a bit. See, I didn't really get to look at these, to be honest. Um, my wife was just like, I'll, I'll find something. And then lunch, they have the pork wraps and the pita pockets. Okay. Fit and wholesome. I just want to make sure I didn't miss... Oh, shawarma chickpea couscous bowls. Saucy pork burrito bowls. Nice. Very nice. Paprika chicken and a lemony sauce. I think I'm going to go with the brown sugar bourbon pork chops. It's calorie smart. 35 minutes isn't too bad. Um... And you can change the chicken cutlets if you're not a pork person. And they also have bivet steak if you want steak. So I'm going to add that one. So now I have in my box the crispy kicking cayenne chicken cutlets with mashed potatoes, buttery broccoli, and honey drizzle. It's a 30 minute meal that's spicy. And uh, brown sugar bourbon pork chops with apple pan sauce, scallion mashed potatoes, and Brussels sprouts. It's a calorie smart meal, 35 minutes. And we're going to keep the pork chops. So at this point, we can hit the save button. And then they hit you with the uh, top up your box. They want you to add other things. Um, chunky beef chili soups. That's pretty crazy. Gumbo and garlic bread combo and it's sold out. Oh no, oh the other gumbos, oh no. Garlic bread. 
turkey sausage and cheese egg fu oh jesus christ all right i didn't realize this was this intense um but wow you can also see the recipe on the site too if you want to make something on your own and just buy things you need at the store yes that is true i was trying to remind my wife to keep the cards that we had i mean they're they're relatively big so you know we keep it keep them like a binder or something and uh she keeps throwing them out i'm like no what are you doing <laughs> Um, so, oh man, so yeah, we saw the premium picks, um, they, they looked pretty good. I wasn't buying it. I wasn't totally buying into any one particular. I liked the seafood ideas, but again, it ended up being me eating two servings of it and that's not good. We don't want to do that. Um, but, uh, yeah, no, that's a good, that's a good point too. Uh, what I kind of already mentioned, like there's so many recipes and it's different every week, so you never get to a point where you're like, oh, I guess I'm gonna get this again. Like by the time you see something come back around, it's it's fresh. Like you haven't had it in a while. Peanut butter lava cake, get the fuck out of here. Pork sausage and pepper for kasha flatbread. You got kid stuff too. I just want to eat all of this. My word. Kits to make sandwiches and pizzas. Buffalo chicken dip. We got lunch specials. Grilled cheese with truffle butter? Oh, that's that's awkward. <laughs> Antipasto boards? Charcuterie boards? Bruh. I'm gonna get cheap binder protective sheets to put things in. They, that's a good idea. Focaccia flatbreads. Oh my fuck. This is probably a good reason why she never showed me the actual site. There's also an app too, which I believe you can do all of this through the app if you're more of a um if you're more of a, a mobile person. You got all these different breakfast choices like oatmeals and whatnot. Oh wow. All these muffins. Almond pound cake. Oh my god. The desserts and treats. Oh. Salted caramel mascarpone cheesecake. Oh lord, take me away. Snacks? Snacks. Just just steaks. Chicken breasts. Ready to eat fully cooked chicken breasts. Bavette steaks, shrimp, ready ready to cook. Stuffed pasta, some tortellini, olive oils, beyond the box meals with meaning. Help provide food to community members in need. That's actually pretty cool. Helps me because I can't have any percent of this page. Oh, that sucks. Uh, but yeah, there's a lot you can do here to add, to add more stuff. I'm going to hit skip because I think I'm good to go. Uh, order complete. You'll receive two meals estimated on Tuesday, August 16th. Um, you can make changes to your order until Thursday, August 11th, which is today at 11.59 p.m. So I was very close to not making the cutoff. Because <laughs> that right now is about an hour and a half. Um, but I'm good. I'm happy with these two selections. Um, and that's all there is to it. So as you see here, the rewards... Oh, they put the reward after. after. So... It's six boxes, but that third reward is in round eight. So, let's do learn more on the rewards. I want to see if it gives us hints as to what those gifts are. Ah, okay. So a gift, the first gift, is a free delicious dessert in box four. Uh, box six, a voucher in box six to upgrade to our premium meals, $15. And then the last one, week uh, box eight, is the voucher box to splurge on our extras? Five bucks. That's pretty cool. I mean, this, I honestly, the dessert box is where it's at. That's where I'm at. Like, premium upgrade that you don't have to pay for? Cool. Some extras. The extra page looks pretty cool. But, uh, the dessert box, though, that's what I'm talking about. So, yeah, 230 million meals shipped in the U.S. in 2020. Damn. Uh, oh, and I, so this, this thing here, I actually was reading this earlier. I think it's pretty cool. 100% of carbon emissions are offset, including the shipping of every box to your door. That's pretty neat. 25 international cuisines offered in 2020. 396 recipes. 21% reduction in food waste at home. 2020 received over 5 million pounds of food for being wasted. Which is great, because like sometimes you make a meal and you have leftovers and you're going to eat them for lunch or another, din like another dinner do leftovers. But you never eat all the leftovers, unless you're me. And it's, you end up throwing it out. And that sucks. 
Uh, and 68% is saved on your budget when you cook with us instead of grabbing takeout. I mean, I, I'm i curious if that's how many days a week and if it's every week. But, um, yeah. I mean, that's that's effectively where we're at with, with HelloFresh. Um, so that's going to come in on Tuesday. So I think... We'll probably do maybe next Thursday. We'll do the uh, the the unboxing. Maybe we'll do it Tuesday. That way everything looks fresh and not two days old. Not unless I fucking eat everything first, right? Sass, welcome in, welcome in. We're just uh, having fun talking about HelloFresh stuff. I don't know if you ever used it before. Um, and somebody signed up for it because now we're three out of thirty-two. So thank you all. I'm gonna go back to dark mode because I feel like I'm blinding myself. Um, so thank you to whoever signed up. If I missed it, I apologize. Um, and, and again, um, if this is something that is interesting to you, do you want to try out, even for just that first week, and then you just cancel afterwards if it's not for you, um, please make sure you use the link. Stream Elements just popped it in there. Um, if not, you could do exclamation point hot, uh, hot sauce. No, exclamation point hello fresh. Um, I'm bad. I'm a baddest motherfucker in the world. Sass with... I hate be you, woo. <laughs> Ooh, woo. Three months already. Holy shit. Thank you so much. Wait, it's great. Oh, my Jesus. Wow. Um, but yes, please, please, please make sure you're using the link or you're going to HelloFresh.com and using the code POGHF. 117 because that then tracks everything back to me uh you get 16 free meals across seven boxes it's actually six <laughs> and you get three surprise gifts which we actually were just talking about here and the one after box four getting a free delicious dessert in box four one of those cheesecakes a lava cake sounds really damn good if you want to try some new things this honestly is not bad the food we got in tried it was good i just couldn't afford it at the time yeah, I mean, like I said at the start, um, this is something that we've been using. We don't do it every week. It's every couple of weeks we get, I think, three? I think we're doing three, which seems to be the most popular. Um, and uh, I've, I've liked all of them so far, if not really enjoyed. Um, the portions, when you're making it, you're like, this is not going to feed two people. And then you eat everything and you're like, I'm satiated. This is nice. And again, maybe you have room for dessert afterwards, you know, and that's fine. Time flies when you're getting spooked. Oh, isn't that for sure? <laughs> Corn husk? <laughs> oh, God. Um, oh, God. Jesus. Sorry, I had to stretch a bit. I've just been sitting down for a little too long, and my back is not liking it. Oh. And uh, another good thing about these two is everything shows up, and, I, and I'll show this um, everyone next week when this box comes in. The everything is literally portioned out already. You don't have to measure anything. Um, very, very particular in that, which is great because it's gonna it just saves more time. Um, regardless if you're 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 busy when you're coming home from work or. You know, you just get off stream. I know there's a bunch of streamers in here. You get off stream and you're starving. And you're like, man, I gotta I, I gotta go do, you know, do a bunch of different things now. And you're like, oh, wait. I got this 15-minute quick and easy, uh, you know, ready-to-go meal. All I gotta do is put everything together, shove it down the gullet, clean up, and you're out of the house. Get up and stretch. Do it for twice. Oh, boy. I guess... Oh, another thing too that's really important. Uh, it's because it, at least it is for me because I'm I'm all about the lifestyle. Uh, the entire packaging of the box that shows up is recyclable, so make sure you break that shit down, throw it in your recyclable, uh, or if you bring it to your your um, recycling center, however you do it in your town, um, please do because it's an added bonus for everybody. I probably will not feel better, but I can certainly try. <laughs> Uh, fine, I'll get up and stretch. Do like some neck, neck stretches here. Uh, let's see if I can move the camera up so everyone can uh, enjoy my, my neck stretches here. Yeah, okay. So we gotta... Uh, yeah, no, it feels awful. 
awful. I don't like it. I tend to do a few of these every hour while I'm working. And I should really do it every hour while I'm streaming. Because, holy shit, it feels this is the tightest it's been all day, probably because I haven't stood up in what? Hour and a half, two hours, something like that? Alright, let's go the other way. Oh! I found out that that pop in my neck, I don't know if you can hear it, I'm kind of far away from the microphone. But uh, it turns out that's not a joint, it's actually a tendon in my neck that is hitting a, the, one of the joint bones in my neck. And uh, like every time I'm telling my random, you're not just sitting slouch the desk for hours on end. <laughs> Well, yeah, of course, of course. Um, yeah, let's whoop. Let's a bit. There we go. Yeah, so it's something I need to get better at doing. I've been doing it more so during the day at work because I'll just be sitting here and just be like typing away and reading through stuff. And all of a sudden I'm like, oh, it's been five hours. Like, nope. So I actually have an, I have an alarm in my phone every hour that goes off that reminds me during the work day. Um, but I need to be better about it when I'm streaming too, I think. So, uh, but yeah. So again, thank, thank you to whoever was interested and signed up. Uh, that was awesome. Thank you so much. Um, and, and I really hope that anyone that is interested in signs up for this, when you get that box in, um, if you want to do like an unboxing thing or if you want to just wait until you've prepared the meal and you're about to eat it. I know Big Meanie said he was going to do it that way. Post pictures, post videos, post whatever you want uh, in the Discord. In a, It's called Food Prawn. Go right in there and just post it all you could. I'll have to ping you on Discord to remind you. <laughs> well, thank you. Um, so I think that's been enough of HelloFresh for now. And I think we can jump on over back to Mortuary Assistant. Um, so real quick, I'm gonna see how many achievements I have now. I have nine out of 21, there are so many. So I still don't have get all endings, but we're apparently one off from that. Um, even though there's apparently two secret ones. Turbo, it does nothing. I know you. Beat the game without embalming all bodies. Yep, we need. We'll get that eventually. Ten out of ten would immerse. Uh, so ten, ten out of ten immersion would immerse again. Well preserved is embalm a hundred bodies. That's just over time. We'll get there. Light them up. Burn fifty bodies in the retort. Again, we'll get there. Effectively having fifty shifts. Uh, embalming a hundred bodies. That's going to take. 33 to 34 shifts. Yeah. Hydrate. Yes, please. And then there's six hidden achievements as well, which I don't know anything about. Um, but, you know, I, I, I hate to be that guy, but... I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna see how I can get it. Let's see. So the basement ending we've got. Hmm.
Oh, I guess I haven't done that one. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six. So this page is actually missing one of them. So apparently there's supposed to be seven. Why can I not go back? There we go. No, I don't want a YouTube video. Oh, I, know. I guess we can do that really quick. <laughs> just found a fun one we can do, everyone. We're just going to prematurely burn a body. <laughs> and apparently there's... Sobriety coins somewhere, but I think it's in one of the uh, that vision when we're in the, the apartment. Uh. Okay, so we're gonna go in here and we're just gonna I'm just gonna grab a body, turn around, and fucking burn it. And it's not gonna work because I'm not gonna have the mark on it. I probably have to grab the clipboard. Because I have a feeling I won't be able to do anything otherwise. Yeah, it says there's six endings. But for some reason, people think there's seven. We'll just burn this one, I guess. Oh, yeah, I'm going to sit back a bit. Ooh. Alright, sorry person, I don't know who you are. You may or may not be possessed. It's a one in three shot, but I'm not it's not gonna work anyways. <laughs> Unsuccessful shift ending. Fail to complete a shift correctly. If you don't add baleful reagent, place the sigil. Oh, I get possessed, yep. Lights out. Oh, oh, this time this is good timing. Just given achievement unlocked. That's crazy. That's such good timing. So it wasn't the fifth ending, but it's a it's a one of the secret endings apparently. Um, so you fail to complete a shift correctly. If you don't add the baleful reagent, place the sigil or mark onto the body or burn the body that is not possessed. We've definitely got that one. I've never seen that one. No. Um, and I wonder if that because it says here if the demon fully possesses you, you'll earn a game over and have to restart from the menu. This is the only way to die in the game. If you burn a body too early, you'll also get this ending. But maybe it just to give you the details of what it actually is. Okay. Um, so unsuccess unsuccessful shift ending, we got that. Successful shift ending is complete the shift correctly and dispel the demonic entity. Do this by discovering the demon identity. Place the sigil on a mark and place the mark on the correct body. Burn the body. If you do everything right, you'll get this ending. We've got that one. I just missed up. What was your ending? Uh, it's called the game over ending. I literally walked in. And I just grabbed a body and just burned it. No mark on it, nothing. Just threw it right in. Um, I immediately, the lights went out and I got, I seemingly got possessed and blacked out. Came to in the basement in that big like wooden chest thing with your arm hanging out. And we were like, what are you doing? And he just sits, he doesn't say a word. He just looks up at us and just closes the lid and that was it. Yeah. Um, good ending. After completing one successful shift, start playing again and earn a second successful shift. Just do the standard shift twice without failing. I mean, I know I've done that. Basement ending in the embalming room. Check the third... Oh, yeah, we've already done all this. Um, yeah, we did the basement ending. Rebecca's ending. 
The trickiest thing to earn in the apartment, check the drawers and collect the two coins and marker. Next, travel to the embalming room and open the drawer to the right to collect two more coins and a marker. Later, you'll be transported into a dreamscape during an event with your screaming father. You'll encounter Rebecca's hanging body, place the coins in her open palms. After the event, complete your shift as normal, successful, successfully burn the correct body. Huh. Enjoy your shower, Twy. We'll be here. You lurk all you want. It, it's, no worries. Thank you so much. Thanks for being here. Um, and yeah, I hope you enjoy with whatever you're doing. And uh, if I don't talk to you, have a good night, man. Uh, let's see. I think we should probably try this. The Rebecca ending. The base ending we've got. Yeah, so unsuccessful, successful, good. Game over. That's for Alright, we'll try doing that one. So, okay, so in here, check the drawers and collect the two coins in marker in the apartment. I don't see anything in here. Oh, Jesus. Thank you for the host sass. That scared the shit out of me. I was like, what the fuck? I don't see any coins in here. Again, no coins here. Like, I can't open any other drawers in here. Oh! There's more. Boom. Ten-year coin. Five-year coin. Necklace. Love you, Dad. Oh. Okay. Two coins and a marker. Yep. Next travel to the... Alright, so we go to the embalming room now. I need the keys. Travel to the embalming room. Open the drawer to the right to collect two more coins and a marker. Oh, man. Throw that motherfucking vase! So you've got a good ending one and two, winning ending where you get wrong body ending after going to the basement, ending where you just burned a body, now working on this one. Yes, that sounds right. Wow. It was lit up for me. So, collect two more coins in a marker. Okay. You can hint for last one if you want to see that one. Uh, yeah, we'll get to that one. Um, I'm going to see if I can wrap this one up. So now i got to go just do my regular work. Um, and I'm going to get transported... At least I can keep track of things. ...for an event later. Just let me know if, when. Absolutely. I'm definitely... I definitely want to get all the endings. Um... I used to be quite the achievement hunter when I was younger. Um, 
I remember playing like the first Call of Duty Black Ops. No, I'm sorry, it was Modern Warfare 2, where I kept playing through the campaign to collect all the intel. Beat the game like four fucking times just so I could get 100% on that game for achievements. And like, I kind of lost my way with it now, just because I want to play a story and like, you know, I'll look out for things, but. Um, but like, this game is like, it's definitely shorter. Uh, in terms of being able to do stuff. Um, the, oh, that's the mark that was just floating right here. Okay. Oh, sit back a bit. I hate when I lean forward. Why did he just, like, wig out? And why did I hear something down the hallway already? Okay. Bam. This man's got a lot of marks on him. There we go. Okay. Let's get some printing done. Pete Rich. 33. This. That. That. That, that, that. It's almost everything. So, Fry, while I have you, were you the person that signed up? Because I noticed it went up to three people. Now, there's a lot of randomness to the game, and that you need to play multiple shifts to piece the story together. Oh, yeah, for sure. It was not you. Oh, interesting. Wonder who it was. Maybe it was Polish. I know Polish sounded like he was really interested. Because he was quote unquote deep throating a Pop Tart. His words, not mine. Sometimes like misclicks. I don't like that. There we go. <laughs> Click back in. Do the eyes. All right. All right. Time to embalm. Oh, fuck. No 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 no. Valerie, shut up. I already have one of those. Oh, I didn't realize I picked it up. Oh, it is red right on the front. Look at that. Okay. Let's make our incision. Start the embalming. I think we might try one box. Oh, nice! Yeah, don't feel like you obviously like have to. Oh, there it is. Uh, that's the good-looking three. That's going. I'm gonna get this really quick. 2405. Sick, nasty. 
yes, our favorite part. Trill car. Uh, IV bag. Fill it with this good stuff. Cooking dinners is a challenge here with work and family, so it could be good to try out. Oh, I I bet. I can only imagine with the little one, too. And then just the, the hassles of your work day. Your significant other's work day. Yeah, I don't I don't see anybody using HelloFresh as a complete replacement for like every meal. I mean they don't offer seven days anyways. <laughs> it's like it's a they do six. They're like, we'll do good, we'll do six. But like even so, I don't I don't anticipate many people deciding that they're gonna have six nights out of the week Hello Fresh meals. I mean I'm sure they exist. It definitely must happen somewhere. But I don't know how often that is. If at all. Not over here. Here we go. Right here is the uh TL. The first body always giving me two. I ain't even mad. Alright, so that's done. And we can moisturize. Alright. One down. Quick. Yep, still scribbling, kind of turning into a circle. What was that? Oh, they got the dossier. Oh! Yep. Stroop, what's up? Thought, Thank you for the host. How have you been, my friend? We're just playing some Mortuary Assistant. We ordered some HelloFresh earlier. Got some spicy fucking food coming in next week I'm excited for. Going well, going well. How was your stream? Were you, um, were you playing League again? Yeah, HelloFresh is pretty decent, dude. Um, I've actually been doing it now for a couple months. My wife's been ordering them. Uh, we get, like, we don't do it every week either. But we'll get, like, three meals. And it's a nice little thing. Just last week, never played. Oh, nice. Yeah, I've never. Um, I I played the uh, the team tactics thing a few times, and it was pretty decent. Um, but I've never played actual league. I've watched a lot of gameplay though. I get the 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 prospect of it. Yeah, if you're interested. Um, so I have a a, a sponsorship with them until the end of next week. Um. So I was just showing everyone a little while ago how it actually you can set everything up. There we go. And uh, if you type in exclamation point um, hello fresh, it'll explain how you can uh, use the discount. I never really played a top down like except Lost Ark. Oh. Yeah, I think I played. I think I, what is it? I think I played like Warcraft 3 in high school and that was top down. Kind of similar to League. Turns out to be like 50% discount on the first order seems pretty decent. Yeah, they the first box, they really get you in there deep. What the fuck did I do? Left arm. Left leg. Why was that being so weird? Oh my fucking sweet Jesus, the fucking albino fuck. Yo, I like turtles too, but you gotta go. You gotta go, dude. My guy, yeah, get out of here. Fuck. Name. Right shoulders, contusion. Left shoulders, contusion. Right arm. Is missing mole. That's probably what I was missing. There we go. Jeez. The guy's like, this guy doesn't know how to use a computer. I'm going to make fun of him.
Yeah, it's true. Have you seen any of this gameplay? For Mortuary Assistant? If not, this game is fucked. You're basically a mortuary assistant. Um, working at night and bombing bodies and determining which of the bodies has a demon inside of it that is currently harassing you and Do trying anything. to possess you. Today I witnessed a crucifixion in pink oh, and God. lavender he is. gold. I've heard people say that beauty is in details, but I don't think Welcome they have back, ever Nox. seen you. There were mortal wounds inflicted on the sky and eliminating blue if got one. on my shirt. What a wuss! Oh, Wheeler, thank you for the host. I did damage. There, there are probably one or two shots. There we go. I'm gonna. Jeez, everyone's in here too. Hello. Yeah, can we not? Let me get to my eye caps here. Very busy. Best part of that clip came after. My friend is a Batman move and kills two dudes. <laughs> also, hi, hi, Jug. Hi, Wheeler. Hope you're doing well, bud. You just missed me, uh... Buying a HelloFresh box. Got two good meals coming in. Next... This upcoming Tuesday, so in five days, I'll be doing an unboxing probably later that day. And Nox, I think uh, I think I've, I, I got a, another ending. It's the they call it the game over ending. I literally walked in, grabbed a body, and immediately burnt it, and um, it had me get possessed instantaneously. And then I came to in the basement, being set up in one of those weird box things. Ah, oh, fuck, I don't have a card. Let's go find another goddamn letter. Or sigil. No, there's already one right there, so it's not gonna be right there. Okay, check the hallway and front area. Yes. Fuck. Alright, it's not gonna give me one. That's okay. We'll find one soon enough, I'm sure. We're probably gonna get transported any second. It's my assumption, at least. Alright, let's do the trocar. That's what you get every time? Oh, that's so fucking weird. Shove it on in. So out of curiosity, Nox, are you are you putting the mark on a body? And then putting it in the cremator? Or are you just dropping a body in? There we go. Oh, fuck. Yep. As in you are putting the one down, okay. Uh, hello? I, I need to report a missing person. Uh, sorry. Uh, her name's Rebecca Owens. She's 14. She, she... She has a drug problem. I, I, I don't know. Uh, she was here, at the house. I understand that. I need you to check them. All right. All right. Do the basic uh, sequence correctly and got a mismatched ending. What do you mean a mismatched ending? Oh, Knox did? Oh, that's stupid. Oh, I had to mix the cleaners in the bathroom. That sucks, yeah. I was like, I'm like, I just, I just was curious. Jesus, I just jumped so hard, my fucking back just vibrated. So I think it's where we get... I need to report a missing person. Yeah, this is the dreamscape. Screaming father. She has a drug problem. Encounter Rebecca's hanging body. Place the coins in her open palms. 
Yeah, this is it right here. Rebecca! Shit! Rebecca! Rebecca! Oh my god. Oh my god, no. No, no, baby, baby, no. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Fuck. Okay, baby, don't worry. It's okay. It's okay, darling. I'll, I'll get you out of here. The police are just right, right up there. I, I'm coming back. I'm coming right back. I mean, he does come right back. It's not wrong. The worst. I oh, know that wasn't it. That was just the the precursor. Okay, I came in here to get my cleaner. But okay, so that's I think it's the precursor to where we're heading. Oop. Where? Oh, right there. That is L with a dot. L with a dot. Right there. Boom. We have three. Now we'll take another one of these when we're ready. This is done. We gotta go moisturize this man's face. All right. I don't see any more marks on him or anything. I think that he had a bunch of stuff, mostly underneath and boom, boom. Yeah, okay. There's nothing really helpful there. Let's get him out back. Back into Why are we wigging out here? Alright, last body for the night. Okay. Alrighty. Let's see what your story is today. Fuck noise was that? Sound like somebody was here. Hello? The door's fucking opened. Yeah, that's not cool. Right, still looking pretty decently sane. Let's check the head. No marks. No marks. Great. I can't mark that from this side. Rotate. Get a mole on the back. Check the arm. It's clean. Leg's got some stuff going on there. As does that leg. And mark there. That's it for that. And then just this one up here, I could get there we go. Nice. All right, let's go put it in the system. Third entry, Jesse Pineapple. In here, Rebecca. Oh, going back to the basement. In here, Rebecca. Am I not going to get the right ending now? Because I can't get this thing to fucking go right. All right, go ahead. Hi. Another sacrifice to save his fucking skin. So I don't think this is where I'm supposed to go. I think I'm supposed to go to the spot where I end up opening up a door, and the shadow guy's sitting there staring at me, and he walks into a room, and I follow him in there, and I see my body hanging. I mean, I was following all the right steps. I got what I was supposed to get. I 
Yep. There we are. Boom, boom, boom. The grave. Click it. Get pushed in. Maybe I maybe I'm gonna get transported one more time. I don't know. It's gonna be interesting. All right, let's head back in, and I will get to work on this third body. Anyways, oh right, I was at the computer. I was rudely interrupted by a talking bulkhead. Okay. I think the event cutscenes are random. Well, it says that it's, I'm just going to be transported to, into a dreamscape during an event. So, yeah, maybe it's just, maybe it's going to happen again. I just need to get to that spot, and I just haven't got there yet. I don't know. But, like, I have all the right items on me. I have the coins, and I have the necklace. Um, oh, yeah. Well, okay. Time to go take care of this part. The events are random. So I... So do I have to just keep grabbing the coins until I get to the right spot? And it randomly happens? If so, I mean, I'll do it, but... It's kind of a pain in the ass. Oh, I didn't go all the way over yet. Damn it. Yeah, I don't think we're going to end up getting it then. This this go at it. But I'll keep trying. I guess the, it does say it's tr it's kind of tricky to get. It doesn't, it doesn't mention the fact that it's randomized. There we go. But, I mean, that makes sense. I'm missing something. What? Did I not grab? Oh, I didn't grab them. I opened the drawer and just never grabbed them. Her her shabberberberm. Right. We can get a new ending on this shift. How? Do tell. And how can I do that, my friend? Come on, waddle up. Waddle, 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 waddle. Oh, do I have to get closer? Okay, I'll get closer. Come on, bro. Oh. Oh, my God. His head follows me. Jesus, fuck. Oh. What have you done that concludes every shift you've had so far? Um, I burn a body. Alright, which one of those bodies was that? Alright, wasn't you that was no wait. I think it was you, my friend, because the other one was a girl. Or wasn't. Why am I no, I have the girl out right now. What can you do differently? Um, not burn a body? Going in and out 20 times into your R for last ending? Car? 
So you just want me to get in my car and leave? Can I actually do that? Not burning a body is a valid choice. Okay. That drawer was randomly open. That's fucking weird. Um... Oh, fuck me, the fucking dick. I saw the door open and I was like, what's that all about? Alright, so something tells me that Nox is trolling. TJ. Three TL LTJ. This one, who's correct? Three TJ TLL. TJTLL. Three TJTLL. Okay. That's good and done with. Let's wrap this body up here. Um, Trocar? Yeah. So, I guess I'm confused. Because if I don't. If I don't burn a body and just sit and wait to be possessed, wouldn't that just be the same thing as burning a body, like, without the mark on it, like what I already did? Or am I missing something a bit more obvious? There we go. I think it's a slightly different end cutscene. Okay. Well, I'll try it then. I mean, I can't get the other ending cutscene, so... I'm all for it. Fucking go in and out of the room 20 times, get in your car and leave. Fucking Nox. I told my wife she needs to start embracing her mistakes. So she hugged me. What is the least oh. spoken language in the world? Sign language. People are usually shocked when they find out. Right. I'm a bad electrician. Where do you find a cow with no legs? Wherever you left me. Why did Karen press control plus shift plus delete? Because she wanted to see the task manager. Very spooky. Fucking dump down the hallway. Alright, I'll just put the bodies away. And I'm just gonna, uh... I guess I'll just roam around. I don't really know what to do to kill time. Uh, sit here. Riveting! Oh. And then after this shift, I have to do another little bit of a talk 
like 15 minutes about HelloFresh again. You could talk to Valerie. That's true. I'd have to go get the key again, though. <laughs> oh, wait. If I have the key code. One nine seven zero four four. Oh, my. F All right, we'll go hang out with Valerie, I guess. I could still enter and leave twenty times. I stop it. Uh, we've met Valerie and Rebecca. Are nice to meet you. you. you lock it from the inside that is outrageous all right bye valerie i could try this one on for size no okay well that was fun can i close the doors i guess not huh. and back we're good we're trying for ending number seven right now with fry's help I essentially need to do nothing until I'm taken. Just hung out with Valerie again. She says hello. Also, is there anything in my car? Old strategy, Cotton. Let's see if it pays off for him. Baloney boy, welcome in, bud. Like I can't start the car. I can't look in the. Glove box, no visors, can't honk the horn. All I can do is get in and out. Okay. So, Baloney Boy, we got into the basement, finally. I'm enjoying it very much, very much so. Um, we're trying to get another ending right now, um, which apparently I can get. Um, by just allowing myself to be possessed. The other one I'm working on is completely randomized when you have certain items on you. Um, I know where the items are now, which is great, but I need to be transported to a particular event in the game, but those are always randomized. Um, but once I get there, I place the item somewhere, then complete my shift, and I'll get that other ending. So, I basically have one through four, plus one of the two secret endings. But, uh, yeah, no, I'm liking it. It's, like, I, I've, I've got scared tonight from, like, I'm on shift what now? I think fucking eleven. And uh, I'm still finding stuff like jumps in this game that I have not seen before. I think I have to keep moving around. Otherwise, it doesn't work.
Just spinning around in circles. Please scare me. Oh, here we go. Jump! Oh, the light's just off. Okay. Ooh. Ooh, scary music. I did miss you, Knox. Brinkum, 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 brinkum. Do to papa, do to papa. We just keep running. Eventually, I'll either get jump scared or we'll just die. It's interesting that that sigil disappeared, though. I wonder if that's just a bug. Quick, get in the car. Nox, I swear to fuck. Again, can't do anything in here. Knox. Fucking troll. <laughs> Jesus fuck my asshole. the fuck dogfish is in here the massive fucking raid as I'm trying to kill myself in mortuary assistant hello everyone yo kyber thank you for the follow welcome into the mob oh my word hello everybody hello hello uh shit dogfish how was uh how was your stream what were you playing And don't mind me don't mind this amazing content by the way. I'm literally trying to kill time. At this point we're just trying to get all the endings of this game. Ah! Oodaloo's in here too, sneaking on in. What's up, bud? Sass is here. Oh, here we go. Rebecca! Rebecca, it's me, Shadow Man! Wait, what? Shadow Man's usually over in that... Where's... Why aren't you coming? That's the little personal... Where are you? Oh, uh -huh. shit! Oh, my God. Oh, fuck me in the dick hole! Oh! Played some Ghost Watchers and Fashions from Amazing Friends. I've heard Ghost Watchers is good. I guess I should be playing it. I have found the owner of my favorite emote. That's good. Fuck me in the dick hole. Yes. That is what I said. In the dick hole, yes. Venus Vol Voldaren? Voldaren? Sorry if I mispronounced that. Welcome to the mob. Thank you for the follow. Oh! Here we go. Finally happened. Ghost Watchers is fun. Oh, good, good. In the dick hole? That sounds like a lot of ouch. Yeah. Welcome in, Lady Shoes. That me, thank you. <laughs> All right, so let's see. Do I get a different ending, or so I get this ending no matter what I do, Chug? Oh, this is different. Oh, I'm chained up to the fucking wall. Venus with a sub. What are you doing? God, thank you. 
Wow. And he's putting me into the other box. What the f Oh my god. Yeah, Doomguard, yeah, it's another I got a similar possessed ending, but I was in the other box across the way. Venus, um, thank you. Um Venus doing Venus things, I suppose so. Give me one second. Um, we have to eat some hot sauces now. Oh my! And another one. God damn it! Okay, I didn't get an achievement for that though. I don't think. Throw the red vase I got today. Our secret below, six feet under. It's just a secret one, I guess, but there's no achievement attached to it. Okay. My god. Welcome to the wonderful world of Venus things. <laughs> Thank you for being here. Um, oh, god. Oh, I like that starting screen. <laughs> okay. Um, so we do something a little fun here. Well, fun for everybody else, not, not for me. Uh, so, every time three subs occur, which is basically gifted subs, new subs... Or resubs every three. Um, I have to eat a hot sauce, and I'm not happy about it. Um, and I'm sorry if I'm I'm trying to catch up in chat. There's just a lot. Oh my goodness. Uh, Kegs the Scald, welcome in. Welcome to the mob. Thank you so much. I should really wait till I know these things. I'm sorry. <laughs> Um, but yeah, so we're gonna, uh, oh, I, I do have to stretch momentarily, actually, it's probably a good idea. Um, but before we do that, let me go ahead and get this spinner going. So, I already had it up to three, I forgot to reset it because I'm a dummy. So, fuck, that's four hot sauces. Oh my god. Four hot sauces and one left over. Okay. Resetting. Plus one. Okay. <laughs> it's okay. It's seriously. Uh, so let's start spinning. Please work for the love of fuck. Okay. Oh no. Twelve is the worst one. Nox, it doesn't work like that. Only I can do the button. <laughs> Fucking god. Yeah, I'm absolutely getting wrecked. So number 12 is the first one. Oh, I graciously get number 3. Hold on, let's see. Uh, number 12. Number... Oh, let's do another spin. Number 3. Number six. And one more. Number five. Okay. Well, that's awfully gracious that the rest of the spins went well because the first one is absolute dog shit. Um, base, you know what? Put it this way. The way that this works is from 1 to 12, it's basically the same ingredients of the previous hot sauce with something else added in. So I'm going to read to you what number 12 is. Because it is the, by far and large, the worst one. Mind you, um, I did number 11 earlier tonight. Uh, let's see. Number 12 is, and I quote, Jalapeno Habanero Habanero Powder. Ghost pepper, ghost pepper powder, scorpion pepper, scorpion pepper powder, Carolina Reaper, Carolina Reaper powder, and three individual one million Scoville capsicum extracts. My plumber thanks you. Doc, thank you so much for the raid. That's awesome of you entrusting me with your amazing community. 
Um, I don't know what to say other than thank you. Um, unless, of course, you want Hello Fresh. If you want some Hello Fresh meals, hit your boy up. I'll hit you up. <laughs> what have I done? I vote 12 goes last, or you won't taste three or five. I always start low and work my way up. Um, let's see. Yeah, three, five, six, and twelve. <laughs> oh, fucking god. Okay. Whew. Number three. It's actually kind of tasty. Not gonna lie. Also, if anyone's interested, um, <clears throat> uh, we've been doing a uh, a, a fun sponsored uh, event here for a few weeks on the stream. Um, I just asked nicely that if you're interested in signing up, uh, that you use the link that's right there in the chat, or you can go to HelloFresh.com and make sure you use the discount code. POGHF117 that way it tracks back to me uh, you get yourself 16 free meals across 6 boxes and 3 surprise gifts which comes in boxes 4 4, 6, and 8 I believe and we know that number 4 is a box of desserts which I'm like <laughs> stream elements why are you doubling up on me <laughs> Venus behave <laughs> Alright, here's uh here's number five. I do have to say number four is actually really good. Like in terms of taste and heat. Yeah, um, it's another lock, bitch. Oh Jesus Christ. Guy will try. Thousand fucking biddies. Venus, thank you so much. Holy fuck. Oh again, number five going down. That's clearly what he meant. <laughs> All right, this one has more heat up front. Flavor still not bad. Venus does not play. <laughs> oh yeah, the heat's kicking in. So you gotta go to a very far, far away place. You have a good stream. I'm gonna lurk. Thanks, Knox, bud. Um, I will probably talk to you soon. I'm sure. Nah, not even. <laughs> yeah, Night Doc, thank you again, man. Super appreciate it. Hope that mustache is being extra sexy for you today. Okay, let's see. On to number six. So this has been nice. We've been going right up slowly. Four, five, six. Okay. The flavor is starting to not be as nice anymore. And the heat is building. Ugh. All I have is ice in my Yeti. I'm going to fucking die. Um, um, actually, let me get one of those coffee chew things I have at work earlier. Another follower. Kidda? I think I want to pronounce that. XOX Kidda XOX. Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome in. Welcome to the mob. I will twy, absolutely. We are doing hot sauce spins for subs because Venus is crazy. Kidda, perfect. Okay. Oh. Uh, this is the worst hot sauce I have out of the 12. I just did 4, 5, and 6, and we're jumping to 12. It's been nice knowing everybody, even if you just came over from the raid. It's probably the last you'll ever see me.
Oh my god. <laughs> no. Oh. Oh, it tastes so bad. Ugh. Oh. My lips are on fucking fire already. Why have you done this? Ugh, oh, my brother in Christ. I don't know. These coffee chews. Oh, we should have to help again. Come on, babies. Um. Honestly, the hot sauces, they're bad. They're rough. I did the bean boozled beans before. Just spicy ones. I and mean, those were awful. Yo, shoes, what up, dog? Welcome in. Oh, my back. Oh, my God. All right, the coffee thing didn't really help with number 12. Oh, God. Just got home from work? Oh, fuck me, dude. It's a late night for you. I can do spicy. I can't do vomit masquerading as peach. <laughs> yeah. <sighs> Ice cream. Yeah, probably. Uh, I have to redeem a stretch, though. And I do need to stretch. <sighs> oh, boy. Okay. I've been stretching a lot of the my neck is I have been having muscle issues in my joints and my back to the point where my left arm all the way down to the tops of my hand will actually hurt like a motherfucker as is my tongue and my lips oh boy all right so I just do some neck rolls Ah, oh. everything is burning. <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh. I've been doing these about every hour of the day while I'm working. I work from home. I sit in the same office, same desk. Not the same PC though. This PC is just for me. And I have a MacBook over there for work. But I'm sitting a lot and I'm definitely not in shape. Oh. But, uh, ooh. Just the way it is. So I'm going to stay up and stretch as much as I possibly can, keep things moving. And I see a chiropractor twice a week to get worked on. And uh, hopefully we'll uh, be back. Hopefully we'll be back in uh, full swing. Excuse me. I'll be feeling better. Looks like you're floating on the ocean. I wish I felt that way. If you ever get squats and lunges, you don't want a hip replacement in 10 years. I'm a nurse. Ah, fair enough. Um, yeah, part of the worst part is I've been having a lot of like random little health issues here and there since the summer started. Little nagging things that basically make it so I can't work out as much as I want to. Definitely can't work out right now. Um, but once this is done, like, I desperately need to get back out working out again. Um, I broke 300 pounds, which sucks. Everyone's like, "Uh, but you're 6'3", it's fine. And I'm like, I don't want to be over 300 fucking pounds. Like, but we'll get there. We'll get there. Um, <coughs> excuse me. <coughs> so, before you get back to Mortuary Assistant, I just got to take a little bit of time. Um... And I, and I apologize uh, that we that we have to go down this road for a bit. 
you don't have to work out with the squats and lunges. Just use one or two every so often to stretch. Oh, I mean, yeah, it's true. It's a good point. It's a very good point. Um, I'm going to try to do this while I'm like my mouth is on fire. So um, there's a few talking points I need to bring up about the HelloFresh sponsorship um, that goes on to the end of next week. Cobra, Chalice, and Frog Post for Yoga to help you. Okay. I've been told to do some yoga too. I just, I'm very ignorant, but I'll, I'll do, uh, I'll do some Google searching and get some ideas. Um, so we're right in like the halfway point. Uh, we started at the beginning of last week. We go to the end of next week, uh, with HelloFresh. Um, I have a, a deal here. You've probably seen it come through with stream elements. Um, I think I ran the command once or twice. Um, Basically, a, there's a big discount on the first box you'd be ordering. Basically, 50% off of however many boxes you want for the first... Uh, how many meals you want for the first week. First, and um, the amount of people that you'd be serving to, two or four. Um, I actually, earlier today, I ended up ordering... Um, I, set up, I set up with a plan for uh, two servings. So two servings, so two people, uh, two meals a week. Um, and the good news is with this, uh, lots of good news, really. So, I mean, first and foremost, um, the food's really good. Uh, and I didn't really anticipate that. Uh, I kind of expected to kind of be like, meh, to, you know, edible, okay, whatever. Um, but it's good. Um, tasty, like, this sauces for everything, spices for everything. Uh, and, and a big part, a big part for me that I like too. It's so good. Oh, so you're so you go through HelloFresh. Okay. Um, one thing I, I I really like is how they make they streamline everything. They make it easy. Everything's already portioned out exactly how it needs to be. So like even the spices are exactly measured out, labeled, good to go, and you just follow the easy instructions to do your do the thing. You do, do do the thing cook you know um i actually so i said part of my preferences the quick i want to see the quick and easy stuff up front um just because i like to be able to cook quickly if the cleanup's quicker even better prepping i usually expect to take a while but even like, a lot of these meals if the prepping's not too too bad um some meal preps are really really quick too from what i've been reading your husband uses them cook well with well without it oh that's even better um, it's, yeah, it's a nice little, like, pick-me-up to have something on the side, especially don't eat, like, I have a freezer in my basement, and, like, if we forget to bring something up, but we have a HelloFresh thing ready to go, it's, like, good to, you know, um, but I really, really enjoy how they make everything really easy, um, because I'm very good on the grill, I'm very comfortable on the grill, put me in front of an oven, or, like, a stovetop, and I'm, like, uh, I think I'm doing this right and like prepping like I just I feel like I messed stuff up or maybe I feel like I'm gonna mess stuff up and then I don't I don't know it's weird it's definitely a me thing but it makes me more confident because my wife does all the, like like all the cooking outside of what I'm grilling and she's an amazing cook and I'm like I want to be able to do that this way we kind of do it together it's it's like fun you know we get together and we're able to you know, spend time together by cooking a meal together, which is nice. Um, and then what I also liked too is um, I I'd say the, the the price at least, at least to start, because um, gradually the discount percent starts to drop a bit. Um, is you're it's it's definitely cheaper than going out to the grocery store and buying everything like you know oh like i need to buy a whole new thing of like thyme a whole new thing of oregano i gotta buy all you know the protein i gotta buy the produce like i mean i'm sure everyone here has been in a grocery store of late like it's everything is pretty expensive um and this kind of just chops it down a bit uh, again, it's it's not meant to replace the grocery store, but it's definitely nice to it's you get a break from it once in a while. Um, and on the the other side of that spectrum, 
which I think is pretty cool, is is the portion sizes. Because at first, I was like, there is zero chance I'm going to be full after eating this meal. And every time I've had um, a HelloFresh meal, I've eaten my portion. And I'm like, yeah, I might have a small dessert after this. Maybe, maybe split a bag of popcorn with the wife while we watch TV or something. But that's it. And that's a lot for me because I could sit here and I could snack all goddamn day. But they seem to nail it right in the, right in the head there, which is awesome. Um, and I mean, we mentioned uh, like working out and everything. Um, they have the fit and wholesome veggie and pescatarian selections. So if you're looking to keep your, your workout goals and your dietary goals in line, they're there to help you with it. Um, and I think I mentioned this earlier too, uh, how they're they're carbon neutral, uh, whereas everything that's that's carbon based is offset. And when you get your box and you have your your baggies and everything inside of it, um, everything, like the the all the packaging of that box, is recyclable. So you either throw it in your recycling bin, you know, break it down, throw it in there, or you bring it to your recycling center, you know, wherever you have to go, whatever your town tells you to do. Um, so I always thought that was pretty cool. Uh, you're looking to, you're not wasting food. You're carbon neutral, or, or you're supporting a carbon neutral company, and you're also recycling. So it's like you're, it's being mindful while also getting a good meal at a pretty reasonable price, and they deliver the same day of the week to you. Uh, one box, bags are inside of it. And then like, I found out today they have all these other extras you can add in there, like soups, sandwiches, desserts, uh, garlic bread. I mean, you got some flatbread pizzas, like it's crazy. I didn't realize how intense they were. I just figured it was like, you know, one week. Is, yeah, I, I actually, to be honest, I thought it was just offering the same stuff all the time. But they change it up weekly, and they change it up seasonally too. So you always have like a really good selection to choose from. And when duplicates come about, it's been long enough. You're like, oh my god, I remember that. It was really good. Let's eat. Um, so yeah, I, I think that's all I'm really gonna say on the topic um, for now, at least. But uh, uh, again, if if you if any, if anyone is interested. Um, Unfortunately, it is U.S. only. Um, but uh, please use that link or go to HelloFresh.com. Use the code POGHF117. Uh, and you're going to get the equivalent of 16 free meals across six boxes. First six boxes. And you get three surprise gifts. Uh, the first one is in week four. It, well, box four. And it is a free box of uh, a free dessert. And I'm pretty sure I saw some peanut butter lava cake on there. I saw some cheesecake. Like, there's there's some interesting stuff in there. It sounds really good. Um, but yeah, I, I think I think it's a pretty good deal. And if you're interested, go for it. Um, if you're not, that's completely fine too. Um, and, I, and I do ask if you do. Um, and if you're up for it, I'd recommend joining our Discord. Uh, we have a quote-unquote food prawn <laughs> uh, channel. And I'm asking anyone that signs up uh, as you cook the meals or whatever, post a picture. Um, or if you don't want to post a picture of the meal and you just want to take a picture of, like, you know, the, the bag or, like, you know, what you ordered, I'd be down for that, too. Um, just because I like, I like to see what other people are into and like hear what else is good because again I'm one of their customers um, and I am like I, I support it which made it easy for me to kind of sign on for this three week sponsorship because I figured like this makes sense I wouldn't do this with like Raid Shadow Legends because it's I don't play that game and I, I can't I can't explain to people like, hey, this is why you should play this. 
Otherwise, it comes across as me saying, please everyone play this so I get paid. And that doesn't sound like it's fun for anybody, really, if you ask me. So, um, that's my story, and I'm sticking to it. So, um, if you have some time to think about it, it is going on until a week from Sunday. So that would be uh, August 21st is when it ends. Um, and we're also gonna be doing another stream, a sponsor stream, I think on Tuesday. Oh yes, Venus, yes, thank you for joining the Discord. I just noticed that you put the command in for it, thank you. Um, so my HelloFresh box will be showing up on Tuesday. Uh, this upcoming Tuesday, the 16th? Yes, the 16th. And I will probably do another sponsored uh, stream that day, and we will spend some time unboxing what I got. And uh, I'm I'm excited for the two meals that I actually purchased. Um, one of them was some spicy Cajun chicken cutlets with mashed potatoes and Brussels sprouts. And the other one was, um, oh God, what was it? Oh no, I already forgot. Ah, <laughs> but it sounded really good. Um, I, I didn't get any of the uh, dessert. Ow, motherfucker. <laughs> I didn't get any of the desserts or anything, but um, I think I, I, maybe I'll try it later on. And uh, and the big thing for me too is this isn't something I want to get every single week. Um, so you have until, um, I think it's the, so like for me, it's 11.59, so in, in three minutes from now is my cutoff. I can't edit anything. So you basically get five days of advance notice of like, hey, make some, you know, set stuff up for next week. Um, if you don't want anything, you skip it. Um, and you can skip as many times as you want. They don't charge you for skipping. And then obviously you can cancel the account too if it's just not for you. Uh, but yeah, I think that's all we got. I think it's time to go to Mortuary Assistant. Again, I'm gonna try to go after this, uh, this last ending I can't seem to get. Um, <clears throat> also, Fry, it just dawned on me. I'm the third person. I used the promo code. <laughs> Gooba. All right. I think we're going on to our... Oh, shifts completed is still only eight. Oh, right, because we did the fast one. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Oh my god. Alright. Oh. So I think we're going to get this last attempt in. And that might be the night for me. Because my back is starting to get to a point where it's like, bro. Love you, Dad. This is enough. Alright, so we got that. We've le we're leaving the apartment. I have both of my sobriety coins. Well, it's Rebecca's and her father's. And the necklace. Now we go into the embalming room and that shelf will like light up for us to be like, Hey, you need to come over here. I'm going to pick them up. And then we're just going to hope and pray that I get the correct uh, dreamscape. Get sent to the right spot. But we'll see. I can keep track of things. Okay. Uh, Venus, have you seen? Has has Doc played any of this? I haven't been. I haven't been able to watch many of his streams recently. Guy rolling. Look at that fucking bulge. My word. Man's got rigor mortis, if you know what I mean. Lily only watched him the first time tonight. Oh, wow. Well, appreciate you coming through on a raid. How did you find Doc then? Because I found Doc through uh, One Speed. This game is a trip. My friends want me to play it on my stream. Don't think I can. <laughs> Are you not much of a horror game player? Because uh, if like if you don't like jump scares, yeah, don't play this game. <laughs> this uh, 
there's a lot of jump scares in this. They're they're very well placed. The atmosphere is very very tense. There's no like timer listed, but you know that there's time. I've seen in the community several times with Midnight Society with Epic. Oh, okay. Gotcha. I already got that one. Okay. But yeah, this uh, this game's a trip. That's what I will say. I forgot to get the damn thing. Keep forgetting to get a... Uh, what do you call it? Oh my god. Oh! Yes! Oh no. No, no, no. I didn't pick them up yet. I forgot to pick them up. Hopefully it doesn't matter. Whoa! Alright, that was new. No. I love horror games. My mom died this year. Dead body is weird for me right now. Oh, I'm so sorry to hear that. Yeah, I know. I can... I can definitely see where that is probably not a great decision um, in, in, in terms of games to play, for sure. Uh, I, I could totally understand where you're coming from. Right, so I'm going to get this bombing report up here. Um, it is really... Uh, it is really strange like what drives a person to do this as a profession like this or being an undertaker or being like a funeral home director because it's like i don't know i just feel like that's just such rough vibe to just be working with all the time Oh, absolutely. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I totally agree with you with, yeah. I think that's, it's like that with anybody. Um, I mean, I I haven't lost either of my parents, but I've lost a lot of other relatives right. and friends. And, I mean, I know everyone grieves in different ways, but, um, like, that's, I, I can only imagine um, the time needed. But anyways change of subject <laughs> um but what other horror games do you play and do you find that you play a lot of multiplayer ones or do you play like uh the single player offline type of stuff hospital to call time oh no yeah you are a very strong person, that's what I will say. And I will leave it at that. Meanwhile, I need to go in... <laughs> start doing weird things to this person's fucking body, bodily fluids. <laughs> oh. Where is it? Where is it? Right there. Oh, it's that weird J thing. Love Phasma, trying to lean, learn for warrants. Oh, yeah. Oh, Madison was so good. We played Madison recently. Um, I very much enjoyed it. Uh, I have not played The Last of Us yet because I do not own a PlayStation. Well, at least not a newer one. The last PlayStation I owned was a PS2. <laughs> Oh shit, I forgot to get the, uh, another card. Okay. Now we need to get... Throw car. Oh, that's right. I, oh, I'm so dumb. Uh, so, bag of rye, I call her fry. For whatever reason. Um, is a... Uh, also streams. And streams... 
What a hunt! Actually, I don't think you've ever streamed anything other than Phasmo. I think you've only streamed Phasmo. Uh, and then Noxler, who was in here earlier, does a lot of Phasmo streaming as well. You just got it for your birthday, Madison. But the Last of Us series is easily my favorite of all time. Yeah, I've heard nothing but great things about it. Um, I've surprisingly don't know anything about the storyline. I just know it's very post-apocalyptic. Um, and go. it just pulls at your heartstrings a lot. And I'm I'm totally I'm totally for that. Like that style of game is great. Um, I think of like Walking Dead and The Road. Um, God, there's so many different ones. Uh, oh yeah, mixing, mixing. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Nope, back in... Another one in here? Nope, it's in the hallway. What? Bathroom? Wait, what was that? Oh, it's just rain. Right there. TL, looks like. So beautiful, I have one tattoo from it and I'm working on a second. Oh, wow. Power, what up? Welcome in, pal. Hope you're doing well. We're just playing the same game that everyone else is playing. I'm trying to get this very last... Uh, Very last ending, and I hope I did it right. All right. And if I did it right, it is a good game. Um, I've got every ending except for the fifth one. Um, I also got two different ones on top of that. Apparently, there's a total of seven. Um, so, with that said, I have one through four, six, seven. I'm still missing the second ending and the last ending. Yeah, I'm working on the last ending now. The second ending is the... Um, I think it's where you have to guess the wrong body. I think if I recall correctly. Because I've got that one a few times. <laughs> the last ending, I'm working on it right now. Um, it has to do with um, the sobriety tokens. And there's three, there's two of them in your apartment when you start. You have to grab them. And then, uh, as well as the necklace that's in there. The one that the grandmother gives you in that beginning scene. Um, and then you come here, go to the embalming room. And you'll find, I think it's the second drawer down. Um, they're there again. You have to grab them again for whatever weird reason. Okay, you have the sobriety tokens. So when you see yeah. yourself and you're hung and the hands open up, you have to put the tokens into the into the hands. And then finish the shift, apparently. Um, I don't know how well I'm doing in that regard. I don't know if I gave it to the right person, but I just did it. Um, so all I need to do is survive and I'll know if that actually worked. You did that? Okay. I think I got the wrong body. Oh, yeah. Um, so I don't know if you ever met Noxler. Uh, Noxler's kind of a, a newer up-and-coming horror streamer. Um, he's friends with uh, RK. Fine. Bitch. Um, I hate to go that way. Uh, but he, he his game is actually bugged out. So he the, he gets the same ending every time. Which is if you get possessed. Um, and you just end up in the basement chained up to the wall. It starts after you inject the reagent into the right body. Activity starts. Yeah. That's depressing. Yeah. It sucks too because he you tell me like he's really enjoying the game and the concept of it, but like no matter what he yeah. does, it gives him the wrong shit. 
Jesus fucking Christ. Hi, Hi. Sleeve Wolfmans. How are you today, sir? Uh, I feel like you could speed run this too. <laughs> Don't fucking laugh at me. XOXO. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How you doing, my friend? How's the new how's the new gig going? I forgot a strip. Nope. Here's the second part. Because the third body usually have activity. The activity ramps up after you get through the demon body. It even says that on the PC in the room. That's true. Oh my god! Holy fuck! Oh man, I didn't see that one before. That's why I figured out the right bodies, yeah. <laughs> that fucking bitch. They shut this light off too? God, my muscle spasms in my arm right now. <laughs> um, yeah. Best part of the game. Filling that body cavity up with fluid. Thump. <laughs> <laughs> Got him. Oh, fuck. This one again. Here we go. I hate this one because I always forget where the key is. But I'm going to remember this time. Because Satan yelled at me like, oh wait, no, this is different. This is not the same one I was thinking of. I just had to grab the bucket. Yeah. EST blank 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 44. Oh, so I wonder is that where that... No, is this... The, the year it was established in 44 at the end. So that, yeah, yeah, yeah. So that was the key, co key card to get that, or key code to get the basement key. Started to pick up on it after I injected a body that started moving very slightly, like the hands and the eyes. That would be the possessed body. What are you doing here? No kidding. All right, let me continue to uh, inject you. Go back and look in the mirror. Did I change? Oh, is it t is it different now though? I mean, I'll go look. Oh no, I look I look fine now. I'm assuming uh, after that scene, I look different. Ah, fuck! I was supposed to grab stuff in the bathroom, anyways. After that scene, sometimes there is more in the mirror. Ooh. That's sketch. I dig it. Oh, Jesus, fuck me. That was where I got, like, grabbed. There we go. Uh, fancy three. How are we looking? Uh, fine. Fancy three. Yeah, after reaging the body will start to move slightly, that's the correct body, and the demon tries to get fused by scratching another body up. I've fallen for that and I thought it was a bug. Cause I remember 
it was the last body I was legit wrapping it up and it was like slice 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 I'm like uh yes Nox told me about that one and so did Fry um yeah it tells you which house the demon belongs to which I thought was pretty cool it's a nice little uh nice little uh cheap move there not cheap but like it's a good strategy if you want that really quickly done all right it's like a fail safe yeah true if you don't know for sure and you don't want to wait too much longer i haven't really noticed her moving at all and she is the second body Does it have to be in that room, or can I just leave her, like, right here on the shelf? Because I'm curious if I just leave it, if I leave her here, will she actually move? Usually the hands or eyes. I'm not sure if location matters. Okay. Hmm. Check the first body, too. Does it... I just saw the shadow move over here, but I think that's just me. That's a little graphical thing. I did this body first. I always do it left to right. Yeah, there's some graphical shit going on with the shadows, because I have this on low. Spooky. Well, okay then. See, this one, it's hard to predict if it's, like, relevant or not. Oh, I see. So that's why we think it's this one? I mean, I'll tell you what. If we think it's this one, I'll just go do it right now. Oh, I can't do it right now. I don't have the fourth thing. I need another... What do you call it anyways? Gotcha. I did not want to do that. Because I need to... Alright, so I got to get the other, mar uh, the other sigil... The problem is, I feel like the the last sigil, it, it won't show up until I start working on the last body. Be nice if we just started smoking right now, though. That'd be great. Can you fucking stop? I, I literally can't stop it. <laughs> actually guess it sometimes all right that's true i suppose a process of elimination can't really tell which house it is yet but we can certainly look if you find the right body you can burn the ash and it'll give you the right symbol it's also true you know what? why don't we just do that makes a lot more sense doing it that way the matches Bum, 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 bum. The right possessed body burns the right symbol. Ah, see, I didn't know that. That's that's a good point. All right, cool. Let's put the cremation bag. Take the ashes. Uh, I'm gonna put it on you. Which one is that? God damn it, I can't even fucking see it. Oh, it's the middle one. Okay. Pound, 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 pound. That thing's just fucking hammering away. So, JTL3. Fuck. 
fuck. Two four two three nine four. Two four two three nine four. Two four two three nine four. Two four two. Two four two three nine four. Enter. Boom. So don't get mad at me if this is wrong. I won't get mad at you. You're trying to teach me something. Um, if this is the right house, I'll look at that. Three J T L. This says three and T L, but not the J. I'm gonna check the other. Oh fuck! Come on, I hate this part. Go ahead, look, look what spotty it is too. What? Attack me! <laughs> I always catch it. <laughs> I always see the movement. The hey, boy's been checked. Is it like right as you're injecting it? Because I usually run off to go look for like um. Have you not seen that one? Oh, I got that one earlier today and I nearly fucking died. <laughs> I'm looking good. That thing finally fucking stopped. No, it didn't. 3J, but no TL. TL. No J. Okay. So it's not in the immolation. I always hit the wrong back button. Let's check desolation and just make sure. My dude, I think you're right. I think you are right. I hit that button, I don't know why. It's Invidious. And it's Kovos. What three symbols do you have already? Uh, Fancy 3, J, T, L. I don't have this one. So... 3JTL. Oh, I fucking did this backwards. Whoops. And then that last one is this one here. So it's 3JTL circles. Three JTL circles. Yeah, that's it. Go ahead. Hello? Hello. Rebecca? I can't hold Rebecca. anything else. What the? Oh. Drop it. Show me one more time, please? Sure. So it's this one here. It's like the three. Fancy three. A J. T. L. And then the... Three lines with two dots. Two circles, rather. And that should match this guy, which, of course, I can't... I can't... Okay. Fancy three, J, T, L. Symbol, uh, weird lines with circles. Let's just hope it's the right body. Um, I mean, it gave us the right sign. when the lights are off in this room. This thing's still fucking going. Oh my god. Are you sure this is the right time? Hmm. I've never heard him say that before. Hey, maybe it's because I never embalmed the other one. If it's not the right body, it is what it is. Um, I won't be mad. I got the achievement for I Know You. Which is beat the game without embalming all bodies. So we know I got that. It makes sense for it to be the right body. Also, I feel like they need to change this so that... Because every time you burn a body, this exact scene happens, regardless if it's the right body or the wrong body. And I think they should change... The thing is still banging.
Ooh! Dang, bro. I got it! I'm here. It's alright. You're safe. Oh my god. Thank you, Power. Hey, hey. But, it's uh. Right. It's alright. This nice moment's being ruined no, by the no. infernal banging. My little girl, don't do this to yourself. You've suffered enough. <laughs> not like her, Rebecca. Your mother. She gave up on life long before she died. What happened to me was the result of choices you should have never been exposed to. You changed your life. I'm so proud of you. Really takes the wind right out of the sails. Not before I heard you. Yeah, this is the this is ending number five. Well, yeah, this is definitely a glitch where it's still going in the background. I think it's because the activity started when the body was up there and I hadn't pushed it in and closed the door. So it was closing when it shouldn't have been able to physically close. And let the dead rest. Let the dead rest, Rebecca. I love you. Dad. I love you. Hey, finally. Achievement unlocked closure. Yeah, this is a different ending. Am I about to get credits? Wow. You just open and close it and it fixes it. It wouldn't let me touch it. It was giving me the, the white X. Autumn Ivy voiced a lot of people. Holy shit. Original soundtrack available on Steam. Nice. Positively spooky. Damn. So there's, there's still a lot of hidden achievements, though, that I don't know about. To all my patrons over the past two years, so much would have been impossible without your support. That's cool. Do we know anybody in here, by the way? I've... Oh, Scaredy Matt! I'm looking as fast as I can. Who else do I notice? Wish it went a bit slower. I definitely saw Scaredy Matt in there, though. Yeah, I, I'm going to have to... I'll probably have to look up what the other secret achievements are. The other ones is just a matter of time. Like, what is it? Embalming 100 corpses and then um, burning 50 of them. I've burned 10, embalmed 29. So, like, it's going to take time, but I'll get there. Ending 5 of 5. Yeah! Let's go. So yes, let's see. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Get all endings is still not unlocked. Something is missing. Turbo, it does nothing. I don't know what that means. Um, wait, I know you. I got that. It said I said I unlocked it. This must be outdated or something. I'm going to actually go check my legitimate Steam launcher here. Turbo is the PC. You have to click on the PC itself in the game. Oh, that's weird.
Alright, let's see. Alright. Okay, so... Just click the turbo button on the piece of the game for that one. I got that one on accident. Oh, I get it. 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 Okay. I'll do that one another time. But yeah, the Mortician Get All Endings is still locked. That's locked. Turbo's locked. 10 out of 10 Immersion would Immerse again is still locked. Well Preserved and Bomb 100 Bodies. Light them up. Burn 50 Bodies in the Retort. And then there's four hidden achievements remaining after that. God damn. Power, thanks for dropping in and, uh, and giving me some tips. Some pro fucking tips, dude. Thank you so much. Um, if no one knows Codename Power, you should now. Please go follow him. I was hoping for a nice scream of yours, but it didn't show up. Oh, well. But yeah, please do follow uh, Power. Guy's the fucking man. Um, yeah, as for me, I was going to try to make it maybe one more shift just to get to one in the morning. But uh, yeah, my, my arm is starting to, starting to yell at me. Um, so I think this is going to where we call it an evening. Uh, but tonight was fun. Uh, I enjoyed ordering the HelloFresh box and talking about it, and uh, I'm very much interested to, to unbox that and, and have some fun. Um, that is way too bright. Holy fudge. There we go. Um, so, I'm thinking Tuesday, as long as there's no shipping concerns... I should be getting the box in on Tuesday. Tuesday night, I say, fuck it. Let's do the stream Tuesday. Um, uh, and I'll do the unboxing. Uh, we'll look at the two meals I got. And uh, talk more about HelloFresh. And uh, see who else is interested. And um, I don't know what we're going to play after that, though. So in terms of... Mortuary Assistant, though. I'm curious if we continue to play it and try to 100% it. Or do we move to something else? I don't know. I'll have to ask in Discord. If you haven't joined Discord, please do so. Exclamation point Discord. In the chat. And uh, I'll probably put something up in the poll. See what people think. Because we have a long list of fucking games to play, that's for sure. <laughs> so, so let's see. We have, um, who do we have on right now? Uh, so not absolutely sure is on playing Cult of the Lamb. A few people are actually, because it's a game that dropped today. Fishboat's just chatting. Uh, Lady Gweebs is playing Bloodborne. First Among Cows is doing Alien Isolation. Max Bex is playing Cult of the Lamb. Uh, oh, we got not. Yeah, of course, Nox is streaming. Amnesia: The Dark Descent. Fuck, he actually went with it. Oh man, if he's playing Amnesia, we gotta go watch him. Plus, I just want to hear Doom music. So good. So let's hook everyone up with a Nox raid. Um, for the raid, you'll notice upcoming in chat. There's two different messages you can copy and paste right now. If you're a subscriber, you can copy that line. Those emotes will work. If you're a follower, you can just grab the text below in the second one and copy paste that as well. Spam the chat and uh, and hang out with Knox. He's an awesome guy, good friend of mine. Um, a great Phasmo player. Uh, plays a lot of the horror games. Plays Escape from Tarkov occasionally. Uh, but yeah. That's pretty much all I've got for everyone tonight. I'm sorry I hit the fucking wrong button on my touch portal and shut the stream off earlier. Um, but uh, we did good. We got a lot of work done in, more, uh, in the Mortuary Assistant. Um, got the end credits. That was crazy. Uh, but yeah. I'm interested to see what comes next here.
until then, uh, rest up. Enjoy your Friday tomorrow. Enjoy your weekend. I'll try to pop in one of the next three days. Um, and that's all I've got. I'm just I'm just blabbing at this point. Go hang out with Knox. I'll see you later. <laughs>